All right, everyone. Chill. 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 I'm just chilling. Brother, just chilling. Just chilling. Let's just chill. Just chillin', chillin', To grant access and insight to perspective I would give you my soul's eye to hold If only to show you a way to get out the cold Exactly. This is the ones where you take the we don't call them bath cups here. <laughs> Would you excuse me? <laughs> That's a shock Give lesson. me one brief moment, okay? <laughs> Greetings and salutations to you all. Tis I, Jess Henry, the one, the only. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Just Chilling with Jess Henry here on Flow Higher Radio. Compliments of Spreaker. Thank you very, very, very much for tuning in. And in righteous form, what we shall do. Is we gonna set the move? Who we got? We got Mahalia. We got Mahalia. And uh, you did not say the original. I didn't say it. No, I was waiting. So uh, Serge has corrected me. Yes. Chillers and chillettes. The original hey, is go. here, and we gonna chill. Oh, shit. Join. Can us. anyone live with Earth? Stick around. That's not for me to decide. Not for someone who decides to live with me to decide. Not for me. But are you willing to compromise within a relationship? To compromise? What is compromising? Compromising for what? Compromising for what reason? You don't have to call me, you don't gotta say it I already guessed love, you've been playing I don't need to know where you are now I don't see no reason for a blowout I was here the whole time, you were busy chasing You don't know what you had, I'm amazing I was all in and you was all out I'll get back up after this fall down Look me in my eyes and tell me you never loved me Yeah Baby, it's no surprise if I was you, I'd feel lucky. Uh uh-uh. uh. Yeah, you strike out all the times thought that I didn't know about. All the lies you deny, but I know now about your hideout. I can't believe you thought I'd never find out. Huh. <laughs> A man comes into my life and I have to compromise? You said, oh, you I think about that one again, again. I ignored the rumors, there's my lesson Clearly I'm the humor, and you've been messing Always talking about the future, when you're not even present Well, I'm the prize, uh, I'm the blessing I was cool to slow down, you were busy racing Had it all figured out, you knew I'd cave in I was all in and you was all out I'll come back up after this calm down Look me in my face and tell me this ain't bravado Hey I let you set the pace, all I did was just follow, yeah, yeah Well, you strike out, all the likes, all that I didn't know about All the times you deny, but I know now, about your hideout Well, I can't believe you thought I'd never find out, no I think, if you were to think about it in terms of analyzing You said all these 
these things? Yes. <laughs> I fall in love with myself. La, 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 la. And I want someone to share it. Just I can't me. believe it that I never find out. Yes. Yes. I say again, yes. That is Mahalia holding it down. Setting the mood here as we just chill. Um, in case you haven't heard, <laughs> Miko White's in the building. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Miko White. What's up, bro? How you doing? How you doing, sir? I'm blessed, man. Holding on to it. You, you know how it is. That's right. It's good to see you. Thank you for coming through. Nico said, man, what, um, uh, bro, what's up? I was like, oh, nothing. Man, let me come through. All right, bet. I mean, it's like, well, apparently he knows our guest, um, whom shall be here shortly. Um, and so I, I welcomed uh, another Tampa brother, brother that I know, you know what I'm saying? Welcome into the dungeon, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> But um, how, how how are things, man? Let the people know what you've been up to, man. Not doing good, doing good. I've been um doing a lot more music videos lately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a little more free time myself, so I've been doing a lot more music videos, a lot more um short films now. Good. Um, and shout outs to you. Thank you for being in one of them. Oh clap, well, clap, thank clap. you very much for having me. Yeah, <laughs> what's up? I'm ready for more, man. Ready for more. A lot of people have been uh, um inboxing me about my little part in that one. Ah, so you've been having some gigs. No, I wish. No, nah, they've been like, Henry, uh, don't do nothing scary like that again because <laughs> I can't invite you over to the house. I'll be like, what you mean? It was acting, you know. It was, I was playing a part. In case uh, the Chillers and Chillettes have not noticed, there is an actual um, short film that I um, happen to be a guest star, you know, background with, you know, whatever. It depends on your depiction of who the star of the the actual film is. You know what I'm saying? In my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> but that uh, no, was fun, man. Um, it was um, great direction, though. Um, you knew it was like, no, I know what I was going to do before we got here. So just listen to what I'm saying, okay? And you say it slow, too, like. Not to not to insult anybody, but it's just like, like seriously, like I'm not gonna say this again, or really don't want to say this again. Please, I, I, just do what I say. I, I gotta work on that because sometimes, I mean, I'm glad you don't feel that way, but some people might feel like that sounds what's the word condescending. condescending. Wow, that, right yeah. on the money. Well, I I work <laughs> I work on the phones every day, so it's very difficult that thin line between telling somebody that. You're an idiot and telling somebody that it's quite all right that you're an idiot, you know, or that you did something idiotic. There it is. Because you're not calling them themselves an idiot. You're saying what they did was idiotic. And that's not what I'm trying to be at all. No, you want to tell them that what they did was wrong. You're not telling them that they're a bad person. You're telling them what they did was wrong. Do what I told you to do and do it the right way. And therefore, I won't have to come in and correct you. Sorry, but but you're an adult. It, it should be easy for me to correct you. And it's not always about doing that. Like, if you've never been an actor, you don't know what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? So, like, you know, that's why you got to – I got to learn to make sure that I understand that you're not an actor, but we're going to try to get you there. We're going to talk you through it. I just got to make sure I don't sound like a mean person. You could curse over here. Okay. It's just me that tries not to curse. I'm trying to be <laughs> professional. And if you get him to cuss, it's $5 in the bucket. Five dollars bucket. I'm not trying. No, nah, I'm, 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 <laughs> I'm in debt oh, because do of I got show. paid five dollars <laughs> on a bucket too. No, okay, no, no, cool, just me. Okay, it's just, cool. it's just a, it's just a. Yeah, we uh, don't have to worry about. It's like a, like a, a mantra for myself. It's like, oh, it's like a challenge for myself. And I think we have, mm-hmm. we have a you guest. Know, I'll tell you one thing. When there's children around, it's an yeah. automatic, automatic switch for me. Like, uh uh-huh. I never recur for when children. Kids, when kids are around, I just Let never it appear? just switch. No, I look at the parent. I look at the parent. Chillers and chillers, one moment, please. I gotta get my hug. Turn the pump! I gotta get my hug. Hello, hello. Sergio, Crystal, Crystal, Sergio. Yes. No, this, this, this. Sit right here, my dear. Sit right here. Yes, pardon the uh, intrusion. 
<laughs> it's like pre- other shows that come in before okay. me, so I didn't clean up everything. But um, matter of fact, Chillers and Chillettes, welcome Crystal and Ms. Work hey. into the building right here. For, for, uh, thank you. I needed the grand fanfare. I needed the grand fanfare. I needed that. I needed that. <laughs> so um, first off, thank you yeah. so much. My pleasure. For coming through. Like, I really, I really was so glad when you were realized, like, oh, yeah, yeah. Really? let's do it. Who, me? Yeah, you. <laughs> yes, you. <laughs> Secondly, I will give you, if I had awards to give out, you would be the number one participant in the Just Chillin' radio show, like, so far. Wow. What? Did you see the work she was putting in this week? Oh, she was right Miss there work. with me. She was. work. She was ready. I was like, oh, this is exciting. This is exciting. So, uh, Chillers and Chillettes, in case you do not notice, Ms. Work is in the building. Uh, We have her here because she asked me a particular question on a particular evening that kind of endeared me to her. And I said, I have, since I got the show, I was like, she got to be in. She got to come on. She got to come on. So I'm going to go ahead and tell this story. It was after a fantastic evening of singing and yes. frolicking and relic, re- reveling <laughs> in all of this glory and grandeur on the stage. And then after, she came to me. And she, we were on the, you know, as soon as you walk out, you got the where the, the, dry, where the parking lot starts. And you're standing on the curb. And I'm standing on the, on the, on the concrete. And you put your arm on my shoulder and you turn to my ear and you say, Henry, you're going to reach out to me. You're going to call me. And I was like, I I said, okay, you're right. I am. I am. She said, we got to make sure that whatever you have and what you're working with can still have an opportunity to show out a little bit. And so since then. That's been right here, right here, love, right yes, here. Yes, man. <laughs> so yeah. So, um, first off, how are things for you right now? Well, things are amazing. Uh, to be honest with you, unfortunately, um, as you know, we've closed the jazz house for the remainder of the year mm-hmm. due to the COVID um, mm-hmm. issues that are going on, and right. it's it, it's just not a good time. Right. Um, it's kind of difficult to be able to. Um, continue on as we were because we are a live entertainment music entertainment um, venue. We're not mm-hmm. a, we're not a restaurant as a lot of places are. So we're right. not designed to. We our, our motto is not is not food. Our motto mm-hmm. is music. Right. So and alcohol obviously. Right. Uh, right. Yeah. <laughs> so you know we have to we 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 had to make a a, a decision to um, to close uh, because it's just not cost effective yes. for us unfortunately at this time. However, mm-hmm. um, we are putting some things in process for 2021 mm-hmm. um, to do some things. So um, we want everybody to hang in there and stay tuned and right. um, always go to the Jazz House's website. Um, that's going to pretty much tell you what's going on, where we're going to be. We're no longer at the uh, Brandon location. Yeah, we are. We're some big things coming up. I see my name out there and some stuff going on. Okie dokie. Mm. Um, no. Exclusive. Exclusive, <laughs> ladies exclusive. and gentlemen. Exclusive. You'll get, you'll get it first, no. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Um, so, yeah, a lot of things are going to happen uh, that are in process of happening for 2021. And um, we're, okay. I'm excited. Um, my staff, we, you know, we keep in contact with, um, manager Jason, just, y'all don't know if you know, Jason Oreo, uh, uh he had a baby, his face. wife gave birth this week to a really? baby Congratulations. girl. Really? Yeah, did. Outstanding. Um, we have, uh, several bartenders, they're doing some things, mm-hmm. uh, uh, Barbie mobile bartending and okay. Juicy's out there doing her, um, She's doing some some body enhancement things. She started her own business, so okay, you know, um, yeah. People are they're they're working and yeah. they're surviving, and and um, it's all good. I'm glad you're you checking know? up on them. Oh, that's actually course. awesome. I'm the work mom. Yeah, <laughs> that's what yep. it is. Yeah, I, I do. And you're from Philly. I'm from Philadelphia, Philadelphia two one five. That's real. Yes, I represent Philly all the time. That's what's by up. way of Tampa. Um. <laughs> Uh, funny thing, did a little research on you, went to, oh. is it Widener? Is that, yes. did I pronounce it right? You did. Widener University. Yes. And you studied 
finance and management. Business finance, but Business. yes. Outstanding. I did. I did. Um, and ladies and gents, uh, this is in Chester, Pennsylvania. Yes. Fun fact. Uh-oh. I used to live in Westchester. Oh, really? Yes, okay. yeah, a awesome. long time ago. Nice. Matter of fact, world, that was yeah. the first place we moved from in the United States from the island. So, oh, okay. yeah, it was interesting. So, so. so, you hung out in Philly too, then in Delaware? No, actually, because no? I was young. We oh, left okay. when I was when we left when I was we got there when I was five and a half, six. We left when I was nine, so about three years, three, three years, <laughs> three, three years. Yeah, three you know. <laughs> <laughs> and we yeah, we were there for a little while. Um, I played for. The Downingtown Young Whippets. Oh, wow. Yes. I went to Exton Elementary School. Yes. And, wow. Um, yeah, we had a good time back then. Wow. It's crazy. That's cool. That's amazing. Small mm, world. Tiny. Yeah. So, yeah. shout out to all the Philly DJs. You know, my aunt, my aunt, yeah. uh, my aunt Elsa and them, they still live up there. Shout out to Tante Elsa, Lisa, Gary, Jerry. What, um, where, they're, where, they're still in Philly. Okay. They're awesome. actually, when we left Philadelphia, they were coming into Philadelphia. Okay. Yeah. But they're... Okay. They're they're the type of people that are really prime time type of people. So right. they were really like what was it South South, South Street South right. Street. Right. So they're off of South Street. And okay, then, I'm like you guys really like living, huh? Right. Okay. So they probably are tuned into like uh, Power 99. I, I listen yeah. to Philly Radio all the time. Yeah, I was yeah. talking to one of the Philly, uh, DJs today. Actually, Doc B. I listen to him all the time. Doc B. That's what's H H Vidal. H Vidal. I remember H Vidal. Yeah, very good friend of mine. Yeah, yeah so. he's the DJ at Quinch. Yeah, <laughs> he's probably listening. You I told him he Quince better be Black. listening. <laughs> oh man, that was back in the day yeah. out there. Brandon, boy, yeah. don't play. Brandon got wild, boy. Yeah. They had some crazy people coming in from Bartow and Lakeland. It was nuts. Yeah, that was back in the day. Yeah, Philly, so yeah, we bring legends. We bring we bring good good Outstanding. stuff. Outstanding. Yeah, that we do. That we do. Yeah. Um, so tell us about Crystal Clear Marketing and Consulting. So Crystal Clear um, mm-hmm. Marketing Consulting. Basically, we are a brand management company, artist management company. Hint, hint. Wink, wink, <laughs> nudge, nudge. Receive. Um, we've we've managed several artists in the Tampa Bay area. Um, mm-hmm. I also, part of that also, um, I have some um un, I'm not going to say unexclusive, but I have some like NBA and NFL contracts that we do. Um a lot of marketing, brand management, a lot of visual designs, a lot of just a lot of stuff to get you noticed and out there and, okay. and you know. So Nico Miko has done a lot of work with us um in the past and, and uh he's 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 part of the crew. <laughs> That's what's up. You know I had to pull that out of yeah. him already though. Really? <laughs> really? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. It's so good to be loved, my Well, friend. you are, apparently. <laughs> fan yeah, club is definitely. following you, my dear, and I appreciate it. But we have some amazing projects that's um, happening, too. Mm-hmm. Um, I, I thought um, Dwayne would be here, too. Uh, is he coming? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. So, okay. Yeah. He's Outstanding. Gonna, um, I told him to come and talk just a little bit about what we're doing on, on the Crystal Clear side. Very cool. To give to give uh, you guys some... some uh, Heads up on some stuff. Well, my head. Yeah. I'm just not going to follow that one. Even, I'm going to say, I need some heads up. <laughs> Even though we have the COVID situation and we can't mm-hmm. get out there, we're still going to um, utilize Crystal Clear to continue to entertain people. Well, there's a lot of ways so, to do it. Yeah. Yeah. So, and being safe and um, acqu- abiding by CDC and right, all that. Right. So we must, we must, we must mush on. Um, Let me see. So segue is it you you united or is it how do you pronounce that united united against breast cancer because i saw that on your little united united so i don't i didn't want to overthink it but i did it anyway (laughs) um do you have any connection to breast cancer type scenario i have a huge connection i'm a breast cancer survivor outstanding can i get some fanfare can i get some fanfare that's just blessed my dear yes i'm super blessed um just to give you a, a uh, background with regards to that, 2017, I was having um, a minor surgery done, and it was discovered during this surgery that um, potentially I could have breast cancer. Wasn't sure. Um, mm-hmm. Doctor sent in, in the um, uh, what do you call it? The, um, Biopsy test. Yeah, sample samples or whatever. It is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and um, yeah, it was discovered that I did have a rare form of breast cancer. Wow. Like nobody in my family had never had breast cancer before i'm one of the wow. very first okay um so 
obviously, like all women, when you find out, you get all, you go into this bubble. I did um, with depression and things of that nature. I'm like, oh my god, I'm gonna die. Human. You know. Yeah. Um. So I went in Tampa um, to a, a specific place, and you know, it was cool. It was all right, whatever. Mm-hmm. But I was still kind of feeling like. Eh, you know, still kind of feeling down and sad and this, that, or a third. And one night, honestly, this is a true story. Listen, mm-hmm. um, one night I was at home and I'm in bed and I'm just watching TV and um, this commercial comes on. Mm-hmm. This is a plug. Okay. <laughs> um, this commercial comes on. It was Cancer Treatment Center of America. And I'm uh-huh. like, wow, I never heard of that. They're not around here, uh-huh. you know. So it had this 800 number. I'm like, well, maybe I'll call them. I don't know, you know. So I called that night. Two days later, I was on a plane paid for. <laughs> plane shipped to Atlanta because they're based the closest one is in Atlanta okay. and um, oh, wow. um, yeah they saved my life <laughs> that's um, awesome yes I've had several surgeries and, and um, I am cancer free thank God hallelujah yes um, and um, I've become a, a, a spokesperson or I do philanthropic work for the cancer treatment center as well you should yes because I want to tell the world that's what's so, up yeah even though I had had prior um, you know breast checks and uh-huh. mammograms and all yeah. that it was never detected it, wow so. the fact that like I, I mean because I, I see a lot of patients like that like mm-hmm. when I hear about it but like the fact that they pay for a trip to come over there like they took mm-hmm. her, they took your case yeah. very seriously yes you know, so yes. it was definitely a problem for me. right it was, it's, it was an, even though you have to go there because you're sick it was an amazing experience mm-hmm. I went oh, yeah. there I instantly fell in love it was like they treat you like like right now I can pick up the phone and call any of my doctors and they will pick up. That's awesome. I don't have to leave a message. I don't have right. to, you know, they treat you like your people. You're just family. It's That's like awesome. I went in there as a patient, but I left there as I'm family. That's so I had no choice but to to put back, give back, um, and to speak very highly of them because, that's, I mean, I get filled up. <laughs> That's what's so but, cool. That's yeah, okay. It's an amazing place. And if anybody out there is listening, if you know anybody, if you yourself, if you want information with regards to breast cancer or any kind of cancer, because they do, they, they it's just, it's a cancer place. Mm-hmm. Um, it's a cancer facility. I would highly recommend that you reach out to them. That is fantastic. Can I get some more fanfare, my good sir? Can I get some more? Man, let me do this. Let me do this. I need a timeout. I need a timeout. <laughs> Let me get some self. No, already did self care by Savannah Christina. No man, where are we gonna go? Where are we gonna go? Man, you know what? All in my hair by Sir Man. Let me do that, cause <laughs> y'all don't know what's going on in my head, dog. <laughs> I'm just saying, mastermind, mastermind. I want to hear this. Oh, I'm always moving. I I mean, I get traction sometimes, but my mind is a thousand miles a minute. But anyway, chillers and chillettes, please stick around as we have Miss Work continue to talk to us. <laughs> <laughs> as she continue to talk to us and chill with us, y'all be easy. Stick around. Y'all know what it is. Just chill.
Yes, yes. <laughs> Thank you for tuning and keeping in tune. It's actually, not everybody can because there are some tone deaf people around. <laughs> Have you ever met somebody that's like literally tone deaf? Like, I don't think so. I don't know. What? I, they I, don't I, even I, speak in the same way normal people speak. I'm just teasing. <laughs> I, don't, <laughs> I don't know. Um, so, as we get back to... Uh, our lovely guest, uh, Crystal, uh, Ms. Work, uh, I would like to ask. I was going to ask about, you know, business model and all that stuff. But you said that we have plans and you're going to bring Dwayne in and we're going to discuss it on another level. So I'm going to just skip past that. Okay. So I'm going to ask next. Um, we'll just get this out the way. Where do people find you online so they can just... Have that good stuff. All my social media is at Miss Work. M Z, like Zebra, W U R K. Just mm. Miss Work. Erwa. Everywhere. Erwa. Yeah. Everywhere. Everywhere. That's what I like. That's what I like. Follow me. Yeah. And you will see. <laughs> see, she's already writing some lyrics for somebody. Oh, don't get it twisted. I come out of retirement. I used to rap now. Don't get it twisted. Stop it. Really? Where really can I see and hear this? <laughs> you really want to see it? I would love I your, to your hear it. I used to be MC Chrissy C. What? That yeah. sounds very yeah. MC that, Chrissy actually, I can C. That. I yep. can see that. Yep. I can see that. Back in, I don't know. I mean, this is probably before you guys' time, but you might know. I'm living in Philly. I, uh, uh, back in DJ Cash Money. Yeah, I heard the name. Yeah. He's yeah. a very good friend of mine. DJ okay. Rand, Jazzy Jeff. Yeah. Those guys. Back in what? those days. Yeah. Sorry, we might yeah, have to drop a beat later. Man, I, gotta oh, see, I gotta see the picture, though. Oh, I, I, gotta I gotta see pictures. pictures. I, got, I can spit some bars now. Oh. If you come out of retirement, as I will. You Chrissy know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, I'm I mean, that's yeah. dope, though. But yeah, I um, I've know? done, I've done radio. Mm -hmm. um, I've done, I've done some things in my past that um, that I had, I had some good times. Yeah, yeah. we're quite proud yep. of that. Yep. See, and y'all heard it you first on that. Just Chilling. <laughs> you know what I, mean? I like stuff like that. I, don't, I, I, I didn't know that about you. What's your favorite food? It's bad for me. Mm. Seafood. Oh. Crab what? legs. Crabs. Why is that bad for you? Because it's gutter food. Gutter <laughs> food? Who says that? Yes. It's the bottom of the sea. You're not supposed yeah. to eat that. Who told you that? Shh, the Bible. Let's Come not on. go there. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. Because I... I, I I had to wrestle you with that one. Cause, <laughs> cause I'm, uh, shut up, Henry. Shut up, Henry. Because Nick Cannon got us all in trouble right now when it comes to religious oh, I'm conversations. Telling you. I'm telling so, you. <laughs> I'm going to be, <laughs> I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be real safe right now. I don't, want the, the I don't want the network try to fire me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> is that the same guy that tried to uh, do a freestyle battle with Eminem? So. Yeah, a long time ago. So, so decision making so skills. That's what you're trying to. Uh, I don't know if it's credible. His, uh, I get it. I get it. 
I get it. I'm there. He has I'm with you. the best choices. <laughs> picking, up what, picking up what you're throwing down there, brother. Picking up what you're throwing down. Nah, that's dope. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, let's see. Next one. Where is your f- mm, top three places that you visited in oh, your life? My absolute. Uh, matter of fact, go from three to one. Okay. Three, two, one. Let's mm-hmm. see. Okay. Three. Number three would be probably in... If Alon Trotman is listening, no disrespect, but probably Barbados. Okay. Three. Barbados. Beautiful country. Um, and I, um, let's see, number two. Number two. You know what? Mm. I'm going to say, I'm going to say number two would be most likely Vegas. Ooh. Mm. At two. Number two. I can only imagine what one is. So. Well, number one for me, and if you really know me i absolutely love the bahamas which part love the bahamas the Zumas, okay. all the other little small yeah. islands i mean i love nassau don't get me wrong but yeah, it's but so touristy exactly. um but i like that small quaint you know yeah. intimate yeah type situation i really want a yeah. hammock i really want right. to wear sandals all right. day like, right serious. right if so. wear a sandal probably barefoot in the sandals sand. is amazing oh. that's what's up <laughs> oh you're talking about the actual resort yeah yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> um, actually, was gonna actually be flying out next week, but mm-hmm. can't go there now because mm. I'm American. Yep. Yeah, some restrictions then. Isn't that something? Isn't yes. that ironic? There's a lot of that going on right now. Uh, can't go anywhere. Go to Jamaica. Well, Jamaican, they have this uh, process of getting people in while like making sure everybody's sterile. Uh, Don't blame them. My kid's mother just came back and said they just walk around spring. Everybody, no. No, 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 no. We, we have, stuff to do. We they have like on the whole island, they had like days. five, <laughs> they had like five deaths or seven or something like that. It's it was so like, low there. Yeah, so yeah, it's tremendously low. Way. Exactly yeah. why, exactly why they act that way. But I, I, I take it from how I won't say belligerent, I'll say bullheaded Jamaicans really are. That that's probably why. Corona was like, I can't mess with y'all. Y'all, y'all are vicious people. Like when they say bun them down, you know what I'm bun saying? Bun them down, man. You know what I'm saying? Like they go, what? What do you mean by that? Uh, Jamaicans are very clean people too. Well, yeah, very, yes. very. I respect that. Very, and they and and, and very uh family oriented to like anything that disrupts this family unit. Right. We must cut it off. Or we must prune it. We must. Treat it like it's cancer. Right. Ooh, get right. rid of that thing. Right. See how I did that? Period with a T. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> F breast cancer, man. That's right. It up. That's right. I actually I used got to have it. a wristband say, save the, save the titties. Tatas, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. It said titties, though. Okay, that's fine. It's it broke, though. Aww. So I think it was, it was a, I think I was wearing it too long. As in, past the maturity level of myself. So I think it embodied itself like the energy of the world. Say, you know what? Pow, this is, well, we you're beyond this. So. We, I'll take care of that. See what I'm saying? Yeah. At least I'm, yeah. that's how I yeah. philosophically tried to piece it together right. to make sense. Right. I just got a new license plate cover and it says, Cancer touched my breast, so I kicked its ass. Hey. I, I saw it and I was like, yes. <laughs> That's so oh, you. That's what you know what I mean? <laughs> 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 Invaded my space. What you mean? <laughs> this is not for you. Yes. That's what's dope. Okay. So, um, would you be able to tell us a few artists that you have, like, as far as... Uh, Currently? Yeah. Um, or even in the works? Let's go back to that. Thank I you. gotta check some paperwork first. No worries. <laughs> no worries. No worries. That makes real good sense. But I can tell you, uh, prior, um, prior, previously, uh, we worked with uh, we worked with Shawty. Remember the song "I Made It Rain." Yes. I made it rain stacks. Yeah. That was that's five o'clock. Our company was five o'clock entertainment at the time. Hey. Uh, we had a Kais, uh Justin James. That's my one of I my like current Just, artists. Justin James. Justin that's James. My Amazing. Still waiting on him on that feature, though. Are you really? Yeah, go ahead and throw oh, that his way. You need to call me. Go ahead and throw it uh, that uh, way. Justin, huh? are you listening? Mm-hmm. Mama speaking. <laughs> <laughs> you know better. Man, I bring the I bring the harmonies in a suitcase like Jeff Dunham with his <laughs> with his puppets. 
I bring them all day. So yeah, we have um, we got some good stuff coming. We got some good. Stuff I'm anxious. Coming. I'm anxious to yeah. see because I'm trying to get you in the mix. Well, um, someone please call nine one one. Yo, know what I'm that's oh. some funny. She <laughs> bring that up. That was a good song. That was a good night. He killed it. That was a good night. That was a good night. Well, uh, I'm no dry ingredient, but I'm ready to mix. Oh, was that? I'm trying with the timing on these jokes. Yeah, man. That's why I sing, though. That's why I sing. That's what. That's actually one of the. I'm proud of you for trying. No, I, I wrote a whole. I wrote a whole comedic bit that says I'm a singer. But I'm gonna tell you these here jokes, and don't, <laughs> and don't sing a lick, don't sing anything. The whole, the whole, it probably wouldn't work. Anyway, <laughs> probably wouldn't work. But nonetheless, um, this is what we are gonna do. We are gonna go. Let's go up late by Ari Lennox. You got that one? Oh, I like that. Play that for me. Uh, yeah. Play some Ari Lennox for me, and I dare anybody to call her a Rottweiler. Oh. Not up in my presence. What? They, you didn't hear about that? Uh uh-uh, uh. Who said that? She went on she went on a whole rant crying because how people were dogging her on, on, on the internet talking about how she looked. The internet her and some other 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 chick, uh I forgot the other chick name. And forgive me too. But they were talking about how they look like dogs and monkeys and all this other stuff. I and I was, was like, pretty. Really? I thought she, she was, was pretty gorgeous to yeah. me. She does this you know how it is, sultry man. Internet, sexy right. thing that I'm like I'm yeah. down. I'm down for that. Like Yeah, I think she's pretty dog. That's like, that's like, you know, like Keisha off of uh, Belly. Yeah. Ah. Oh, oh. What? Keisha was another That's girl. what I'm talking about. Like, she makes Keisha my face was, go oh. like, ooh, listen, what listen. would I do for this love? I don't like, know, Kiana. I was mad at DMX. What? You would you say Rihanna? No, they was like, oh. <laughs> DMX, I don't know no Kiana. <laughs> right. Oh, God. That was awesome. This took me a, on a trip. But we just chilling. Chillers and chillers, stick around. All right? Love y'all.
flow, give your ass a duplicate fob, nigga. Fifth floor, devour that body like one on a cob, nigga. Fifth floor, neighbors must be questioning my job, nigga. 5 a.m., cause you stay a little longer. Ammonium nitrate may have sparked the Beirut explosion, similar to what happened in Texas in 1947. Uh, Lebanon's government has blamed a large quantity of poorly stored ammonium nitrate for the huge blast that rocked the capital. The explosion killed possibly over 50 people, as have reported so far, and has caused a large amount of damage to the city. Um, it's an industrial chemical uh, commonly used around the world in agricultural fertilizer and in explosives for mining. Uh, officials say there were about 2,759 metric tons of the chemical uh, a few minutes walk from the city shopping and nightlife districts. Uh, due to the gas, uh, that's all the science. I don't know if y'all want to know about the science, especially describing how the blast was so awesome. I thought it was awesomely terrible. Like, there's so many sides of me that's like uh, uh, activated in this situation. Like, my heart's like, what? And then my energy of like science and physics and stuff like that is like, did you see the cloud? Did you see the the blast? The it's energy? Crazy. And then I'm like, this is terrible. Why? Why am I? Why am I thinking of that right right now? You know, like. Right. But then you have to grasp reality and then i start praying and right. making sure that um i take care of that so did you hear about this at all yet what are you because i even had another friend of mine that was in the navy with me hit me up and was like i think foul play and i'm like mm. well instantaneously that's what naturally you would think terroristic something and then you think Oh, it was created, or it's not true, or mm -hmm. you know, you just don't know. I mean, right. we're in some crazy days, <laughs> right? And it's it's just it's just we live in the world we live in now. It's just it, it just blows me. It's, it's sad. It's pretty sad. Very, yeah. Very. But you know, my heart goes out to the families and to to Beirut because I mean, I saw it. I was like, oh my god! It was like two times, like yeah. boom, then boom. Yes, it, it was crazy. It was so, nuts. Yeah, but you know, sadly. It's on and it's being publicized, but it really isn't. Really, it's not. It's not. No. Nope. Everything nope. is COVID, 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 COVID. Yep. So I'm like, well, what about the explosion? They don't want. <laughs> they don't yeah. want you to know that. Don't pay right. attention to it. Ah, just so. don't. Don't worry about it. It's okay. Yeah. So. Well, my only thing is, I took away from the fact that this chemical is used in explosives. So I mean, there's possibilities, but there's nothing concrete that you can kind of build a whole case on so i was just like uh, yet again <clears throat> the media has thwarted me again the media <laughs> i feel like i feel like i feel like there's so much more like i watch too many espionage uh tv shows ncis and stuff uh -oh. Yeah. oh man like, yeah this whole situation's fishy huh dude Maybe it is a maybe there's a part of me that just wants it to be that. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I be need more to get, interesting. <laughs> I guess more drama. Yeah. Uh -oh. Am I? Am I? That's the American in me. Yeah, man. <laughs> was that? Was that? Was that a jab? <laughs> that was funny. I thought that was funny. Anyway, on with the news. Cory Bush. A progressive activist whom beat a 20-year Democratic incumbent in the Missouri primary. Oh. Curry Bush, one of the leaders of protests against the police shooting of Michael Brown in Ferguson, Missouri, oh. defeated longtime Representative William Lucy Clay. <laughs> Lucy. Hey, in the Lucy. state's Democratic primary election on Tuesday. Clay was elected in the year two thousand 
taking over the post from his father, who had served for 32 years before. That's 52 years of the same Same. ideology, (laughs) of the same... Uh, I guess that's why Missouri has always been known as the Show Me State. Show Me State, right. They came up with the mm-hmm. model and kept it there for 52 years. How many years? 52. 52. <laughs> 52. 52. It's two more than my age, almost. 52. 52. That's, that's hey. half a century. That's a, that's a good. Don't, don't make it sound like sorry. that. I'm sorry. That's a diamond. That's a diamond. There you go. I mean, I'm embracing it, but don't, don't, don't. Diamonds are forever. There you go. Boom. Hey. That's my name, Diamond. <laughs> <laughs> That's an insider. <laughs> <laughs> yay, yay. <laughs> <laughs> don't pay me no mind. It's the water. They oh, have me drinking God. in here. It's the water. It's the called fire. Roxanne. Roxanne. Right. Roxanne water. <laughs> that fire water. Oh, with a splash of dole. That's so funny. Pineapple. Oh. <laughs> I'm just saying, in the red cup. <laughs> Actually, just chilling. Yeah, right. That's word. <laughs> oh my god! All right. So, uh, what was I gonna go? Oh yeah. Uh, this win is after she actually entered politics after the Ferguson protests in 2014. Uh, she first ran for the representative seat in 2018, where she actually lost to Clay. Uh, she campaigned on issues such as a fifteen dollar minimum wage. Free college tuition and Medicare for all. She actually received a uh, stamp of approval from good old Bernie Sanders. Good old, old Bernie. Bernie. Yeah, I, I like Good old I like Bernie. Bernie. I would have voted for, for him. If oh, he Bernie. In. Yeah, the black man's white man, Bernie Sanders. Yes. No? 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 Hey. Just, <laughs> Hello? I'm trying to figure it out. I missed it. I missed that? To, what happened? <laughs> nothing. He was cleaning his nails. He's cleaning his nails. Yeah, I had to reply to it. Yeah. <laughs> you know. His last girlfriend told him he had to keep that. He had to make that a habit. Keep your nails clean. Oh, there's a little manicure. A little bit. See? Okay. She's like, oh, I I I might be it in my nails. (laughs) (laughs) Probably take those pills for the for the hair hair nails. I smoke a lot of weed. I think Ah! that. That doesn't think, help. Hey. Yeah, it does. It makes it your nails grow faster. I swear I they grow a lot faster. I thought you said about the beard. Oh, same thing. I thought you said about the beard. No, it doesn't. I think same thing. Smoking weed don't make you grow. I, mean, I, so. I learned something. I, I didn't I know think that. So. That's I like think it does. It, grow, it grows. It grows. It's growing a lot faster. You think it does, but did you Google it? I haven't Googled it. All right. They're not going to tell you. That's how rumors start. They're not going to tell you the truth. I don't want you to know. Because <laughs> oh. everybody does it now. Everybody's got big, luxurious, beautiful beards. Oh, wow! So all of them, all of I them don't smoke, smoke weed, weed, right? Neither do I. And I, I cut my beard a lot. I actually need to grow. I was about to say. Let me see. I gotta Gucci. trim my. Oh, you Gucci? I trim mine. Got little, yeah, you got I trim mine, buddy. My 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 beard does not behave when I start trying to grow it out. It does this curly. The curly, yeah. My, I got the curly stage. Joint. You got to get past. You'll be all really? Right. Yeah. You gotta get How long is that stage? Is that the like the 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 nappy, yeah, ugly three, stage months, or the dreads too? Three, four months. I did that once. I don't need to do it again. After that, three or four months. Then you, three, four months. You're gonna Rick Ross it a little bit. Uh, oh right. no, yeah. that's too much. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Too much. Wow, I got a lesson. It just <laughs> I'm saying, just though. chilling. But hey, honestly, you always learn something here on Just right, Chilling. Right, I like it here. You're always learning something. And Miko bringing in the knowledge that it's easy. Uh, Miko. Hmm? We, need, we need to get one of those, uh, we need to get the organ, we need to get the organ one, just like the coronavirus one we have, the little the little punch in. We need to get an organ one. Dun, dun, like when we got a, no, uh, uh, I don't want to, I don't want to go to church. Uh, yeah. That'd be too far. You ever see people go too far with the church too? Too church with Yes. My How off? Oh, my goodness. It's one of the most, it's like a pet peeve of mine. It's like a time and place for everything. But if I'm at a show. Who's your cousin? Oh, yeah, that's my cousin. Like a little bit. Means, but he, when, he, when he first got saved, he decided to go into uh-huh. preaching and all that, and he mm-hmm. just went over the top. He, so one day he decided to tell everybody in the family unit that they're all going to hell. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. nice. I hope he's not listening. As he well, he needs Bible, to listen to this. As he holding a Bible every single one of you was going to I don't like, like Oprah, you go to hell. You yeah, to hell. yeah, giving it out. <laughs> like free tickets. But he, Do not pass go. Like, Cuzzo, Cuzzo, but he's, he's over down. that phase. He's good now. Yeah. <laughs> no, it was hilarious, but he's good now. He's, he's like, he what's, beard? yo, what's no, the dude like, name? No, no, no. What's the dude <laughs> name? He's a tall, light-skinned dude with braids. 
that just got out of jail and he was on uh, 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 public television. What are he doing? The, you know, the and he was thing? cursing at people. Talking he was preaching. Yeah. That reminds me of that moment. He was like the so, rapping preacher or something? Yeah, he was going off on people. Oh, okay. He was mad at people. I'll show you. We got to show you offline. Yeah, I want to see this. I got to show you offline. But instead of that the doing now, okay. we will do this. On with the news, sir. New York City Uh-oh. sets up quarantine checkpoints as it toughens state travel restrictions. They should have been there. They're the number one corona catching people. Oh, just you. No, no, Miko. Miko, your is. comment aligns co- directly with my next report, sir. Oh, I'll be quiet then. No, it's okay. Sorry. No, 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 no. I it's appreciate a great that's a nice segue. Segue. Shut up. No, I appreciate the today. banter. I appreciate the banter. Oh, that that was my nice way of saying, "Give me a moment, sir." Give him a moment, okay. sir. Yes. Okay. Yes. Thank you. See how see how eloquent black people can be when they want to be. <laughs> He's so stupid. So Checkpoints. <laughs> <laughs> Checkpoints are being set up at key entry points along main yeah. bridges and tunnels to the city to screen some incoming travelers, according to Mayor Bill de Blasio. De Blasio. De Blasio. De Blasio. This is required, not an op- not optional. What's up? The boss is What's in the right? building. Man, welcome, welcome. De Blasio. Hey, welcome de Blasio. Good Thank you very much for coming in. You opened the door like it was a horror movie. It was really slow. Yeah, I know. I like the sound of it. Yeah. Yeah. I like the sound of it, so that's why I did it. That's why I don't use WD-40 on that door. No, yeah, not at I, all. He likes I it. I actually like the sound. It's like a great entrance. Yeah. You know, and, I'm here. I don't so need a horn. I had to, I had to come. Door I, squeak. Uh... The queen felt it was only right. Who? Yeah. Who? Who? The she, queen. The queen felt the that queen, it was only the right. The queen beckons, she and we follow. Yeah. She, yeah. she felt that it was only right that I come That's up. Right. Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't. I don't know how far y'all got into the history. Not but. too. Not too far. We we actually were awaiting you for for all things that. That may be I wanna, uh, I'm so crystal excited clear. about what's going on. I want to tell, but I'm like, I can't tell. I can't tell. She was like, I need to know which one is which. I uh. can't tell. Listen, when it comes to CCMC, which stands for uh, Crystal Clear Management and Consulting, mm-hmm. we are on fire. Hey. You understand, yes, you understand yes. me? On fire. We are on fire, right? Yeah. We are on fire. You know. um, DGM is just a subsidiary of CCMC. Oh, a lot wow. of people don't know that. Wow. Yeah, DG- I didn't know that. DGM is just a... I didn't know that. The artist it's, management. You didn't even tell me that on our interview when you were on my show before, listen, though, sir. You holding out? You holding out? Ah. Listen. You holding listen. Out listen. I know, it's teasing. <laughs> listen. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, man. Crystal uh, Crystal and I have been... God, how long have we been in business now? 13 yeah, 12, 13 years. That's awesome. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we be, a lot of people don't know that. No, that's beautiful. Because we be on the low. Yeah. But um, it, it's. Don't be a, all in the videos. Yeah, you know, no, dancing all on the and stuff. Record. Yeah. We go, Come dancing. to CCMC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we have people the best that. Ever, like, oh, man. We, we give ultimate support, guys. Right. Mm. Yeah. Oh, man. my God. <laughs> but yeah, you, you, you could not have had a better person come up here. Yeah. Um, Good. Could not have uh, had a better person come up here to to interview because you know um most of the bosses in the city are men. Mm. Mm-hmm. You see where I'm going at with yes, this? Yes, sir. Test? Most of the bosses in the city are known as men, mm-hmm. but there is one boss mm-hmm. that is the queen mm-hmm. boss. Okay, and that's Crystal, mm. and I'm just I'm not, I ain't trying to big her up, mm. but she's been making moves. I, she's been making moves with me for a long time. Outstanding, but, but you know, independently, she's been doing a lot of stuff, okay. and not just in the entertainment industry. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So uh, yeah, she was saying that. Yeah, her her story is uh, is extensive. Yeah, but you know, for for some of the older listeners out here, okay. 
when you put us together, we form like Voltron. Okay. Oh, yeah. You understand They got saying? a new Voltron now on yeah. Netflix. Be all, careful. Hey, all I'm saying is when you put us together, <laughs> we form like Voltron. That's we, word. We are undeniable. I'm, I'm and and, and uh, if you look at the last uh, 10, 10 to 15 years in this city, um, we have continue to evolve mm-hmm. continue to change our business model yeah. and we can and we're still here yeah that's whereas right. a lot of people started with one business and then moved to and then that failed mm-hmm. and then they didn't know how to recover mm-hmm. so they kind of walked away and went back to just doing you know blue collar or whatever the right. situation is and there's nothing wrong with that right mm-hmm. but we have continued to change our business model and business model and even when I physically walked away, Crystal was like, I'm going to continue to stay in. Mm-hmm. And so, Grindy. you know, most people that know my story, uh-huh. when I came back to this music business, it was because of the artist think Justin James. Yeah. And so Justin hounded me for six months, letting me hear his stuff. And I'm like, yo, I'm not doing music no more. I'm out. I'm just a fan now. <laughs> right. And I'm serious, man. Ser- serious mental breakdown, right. emotional breakdown. Like I was right. done. I you know what I'm saying? And so I, we He's can like, tell I y'all. Do music anymore. We I can tell y'all about that. It. You know, we we can cover this. some of that history, right? Yeah. But um, Justin was the one who pulled me back, and when he pulled me back, I came right back to my partner and I said, "I think this kid's got something." Do you, and I think the exact words I said to her as I said, Crystal, I said, I think I, I said, so let's dance one more time. She's like, if you want to do it, boss, let's do it. And I'm like, let's go. That's what's up. And I've not looked back since. Dancing with the stars. Yeah. And so, you know, <laughs> and so from a history standpoint, you know, I started a label back in 2001. Okay. And that label was called Five O'Clock Music. Yeah. She mentioned it. Yeah. And so um, at the time. I formed a label for a local DJ who turned artist by the name of Strizzle. Yeah. So back then his name was DJ Daddy Stro. Okay. Right. And so, <laughs> you know, and so because of Strizzle, uh-huh. um, you know, we had a, a very good collective. Some of that collective right. was um, uh, a local rapper by the name of Shiesty, uh Jack P, and uh, today. Mm-hmm. Uh, the well-known artist Two Pistols. Uh-huh. Uh, Jay Saunders now. Oh, yeah, Jay Saunders. He's Jay Saunders, he's Jay Saunders, now. Jay Saunders oh. now. Shout out yeah, to Two Pistols. Two, 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 two P. Yeah, he's evolved. Okay. And then he so, went to Two P. Two P. And now he is now he's Jay, Jay Saunders. Saunders. Yeah. Okay. Hey. So, um, yeah, and so, you Make know, sure. we were putting out records, yes. uh, you know, so for some of the older hats, you had the records like Low, Low, mm-hmm. and uh, Do Your Dance, yeah. and then uh, It's My Dog's Birthday. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So these were all the records. And so when these things were happening, mm-hmm. only thing I knew was, the you know, the development and the management side of things. Okay. I needed somebody to come in and handle the business. Yeah. Because you can't be with the artists and develop, you know, develop the, the product and, and focus on handling the money and making sure the contracts are straight and making mm-hmm. sure we're a business in the state of Florida and we have a business account mm-hmm. and, you know, and paying taxes and, you know, setting up the publishing administration and getting an entertainment attorney. And Jeez. it's like all this stuff that people now come to me to guide them through. I had to get somebody to help me Mm -hmm. who had a very good business sense, period, hands down, real estate, hands down, Mm -hmm. travel industry, hands down, can't, to this day, you can't, you can't mess with her. That's dope. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. And so, and there's somebody who, I don't don't even have to blink. (laughs) I spend a, I spend a dollar, I get a receipt, Crystal, here's a receipt, Mm. here's a check. This is what we doing. You know what I'm saying? Get you somebody who you can absolutely trust. That's right. You know, and and don't get it, don't get it twisted. There's been plenty, plenty. We we butt heads all the time. All the what time. Mean? It's human. We butt human heads all the, time. all the time. You know what I'm saying? And then of course we have outside people who have different experiences with her. Mm-hmm. 
than they have with me mm-hmm. and vice versa. Right. Okay. And so then there's the I don't want to work with her, mm-hmm. but I, I want I want to work with you. Mm-hmm. OK, cool. I get it. You know what I'm saying? So I will focus. She's shaking her head like, are you going to be? So I, so no, I, you, or you're like, no, it's, we, it's we better good, off? No, we do good cop, bad cop. That's all yeah. we do. I mean, but I mean at the end good, of the day, we're, we're but it's, it's the same. Yeah, but, the goal, but goal is the same. That's what but it's never moved. I'm no nonsense. I, I just. Yeah. And it's never, and, and it's ne- and I've never moved uh-huh. without Crystal. You know I get what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Um, it, it's never happened, and so you see the separation uh-huh. for the perp- for the greater good of what we're trying to accomplish. Okay, but we continue to evolve. That's where you understand what I'm saying. Should, you know, and, and, and bosses move yeah. as bosses move, right? Right. So as the market, does, this yeah. is where we're at. That's what's up. Man. But the reality, this is. And so I came. She wanted me to come crash the party because. <laughs> That's it's what time. It's do. time in in, t- in 2020. <laughs> uh-huh. It's time to start connecting the dots. Right. Yes, sir. You see what I'm saying? Absolutely. So yeah, you see me over here, and I'm I'm doing this. Crystal's over here. She's doing this. Mm-hmm. But a lot of people don't know. This is the this is a different arm of the same octopus. Wait, <laughs> that's a, that's all it is. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? So it's a very good analogy. I like that very much. I'm just trying. I had, I had a little, uh, little Little Mermaid episode the other day. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, but, but when I, but, but, I, you know, just, just, you know, getting through the story. So yeah. when Crystal came in, mm-hmm. um, was at the time on uh, that Strizzle discovered uh, uh, R&B artist named Shoddy. Okay. And yeah, yeah, um, yeah. And so then, you know, we had this record. He, they did a record called "I Made It Rain." Yeah, and um, and so again, yeah. here we go again, right? Yeah. Um, and 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 that's not even that's not even counting like before Shawty, we partnered with Lil Key. Okay. And when Lil Key had Javon Black. Yeah. And the first hey, pre- hey. during the Super Bowl, <laughs> the first pressings uh-huh. of Shorty Shorty Chair It Up. Yeah. If you if you have like a CD from that time, uh, you'll see it says Key Zone and Five O'clock. Mm-hmm. It's oh. on the disc. Mm-hmm. Very good. You understand what I'm saying? Yes. So I, there's not too many records that I haven't been a part of mm-hmm. out of the city. Yeah. I mean, I, you know, I, I take no credit on Tom G. Uh, I take no credit on um, Hater Blockers. Why not? Act a fool. I, I take no credit on ha- hater blockers, right? I, so. I wasn't involved in that. But we, I take we no work credit. With I take I take no credit on famous kid brick. Although when I got out of the got out of the business, uh, they did pull me over there to help put some business mm-hmm. plans and some stuff together. Um, and I was getting ready to be team famous kid brick to help from the behind the scenes from a business perspective Mm -hmm. but dude i mean when you reach (laughs) when you reach a point in this business where you're knocking i mean where where you've now been a part of a record deal with universal republic for john javon black Mm -hmm. and the label was fighting to get drake so they dropped all artists Mm. and never impacted the record so you never got your check and then you turn around and you find Shoddy mm-hmm. and you're getting 800 spins a week mm-hmm. on I Made It Rain. And you've got a private investor coming to the table with $300,000, dollars $375,000, right? A cigar company endorsement, mm-hmm. Right. And your artist tells you <laughs> on the day of signing, I'm jumping ship. <laughs> it can be very, and you're sitting here going, yo, and I got producers lined up to like evolve him from where he's at now into so what maybe a Chris Brown would have been or, you know, uh, taking in that lane. So the quality of the music and stuff. So when you get to that level, so, I mean, to go from the disappointment with the Javon Black project, hmm. right, to now I got shorty and I'm sitting here with $375,000 on the table for this kid. Mm-hmm. And then he says, I don't want to do it with you. I'm going to go over here and do it with these people. 
and now you're with the attorneys and everything going okay, you want to go, go, but I'm keeping everything that I put my money into because we paid for everything, right? So you can go and do whatever you want to do. A whole album that's just fire that never came out. Hmm. Right. You know what I'm saying? It made me, I I had a, I, I got depressed hmm. from a business perspective. I got I depressed, it. you know what I'm saying? And hmm. so I, I got out. I, get it. I was like, I don't want to do it anymore because, you know, I, I don't think a lot of people understand when you when you manage and you consult an artist and you guide an artist's career it's not just their music it's their life. Their whole lying life. to their girlfriend that yep. they that why they didn't come home that night no it's, he wasn't in the strip club no no it's it's he bail money me. it's bail money it's <laughs> i don't have money for my lights here's the money it's using the company debit wow. card to rent cars and running up parking that. tickets in Ebor, mm-hmm. you know, and having to go to court to to prevent going to jail because those parking tickets weren't done, and I wasn't even the one driving the car. It's it's that, understanding all the stuff that makes the artist the artist, so that they can focus on just being the artist. That would drive anyone mad, yeah. dude. I mean, I, I that's it. I, I couldn't I couldn't do it anymore. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and bear in mind, before all this happened, yeah. I was an artist. Yeah. I was in a group. Get out of town. We went on tour. I mean, I toured with Mary J, Nas. I've been on tour with Montel Jordan. I've been That's on tour. I mean, I did dates with with uh, NSYNC. You know what I'm saying? So I was in a group and did touring. And I stopped because my group members turned and did some things that I didn't agree with. Mm. And so the group broke up and I turned to the business. Okay. And so now I'm living vicariously through everybody I work with. I get it. And so every time that I work with somebody, I pour my heart and soul into hard. the project. Mm-hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? He does. Sir, a lot of I'll, time- real quick. Go ahead. I was plugging by saying every time I've ever seen you, you've held your artist in the highest of, regard, of esteem and regard, bro. Like, I've never seen them be thirsty. No. Never seen them even be thirsty. You take great care. I appreciate you recognizing that. That's just I've, that's, I've, I've that's, had that's plenty dope. of times, man, where I've gone places, man, mm-hmm. and people think I'm the bodyguard. Yeah, because you don't. And you guess like, what? And guess what? I tell people. What's up, Debo? I don't. You don't need to know who I am. Yeah. You, do you know who the artist is? That's then real. I'm doing my job. That's real. I don't. I never cared about that. No. That's good. I never cared about you know like oh I'm the big guy I'm this I'm that like when she told me about coming up I'm like that's your interview like you go she's like I want you there I said like, okay I'll come because you asked me to come yes that's but I never cared about that right so when people hit me up they're like oh so what do you do I'm like what don't I do. But I don't say that to people. Mm-hmm. Not, Nico not knows. Start. Yes. Crystal knows. Mm-hmm. You may even know. Yeah. There's not much that I don't do, but I'm not going to say that to well, you. I don't know everything you do. But I don't know everything you do. But I'm not going to say that to you. No, I get it because you're not a boastful, because, braggadocious yeah. type of guy. You know why? At all. Because it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Right. Your doesn't. work, let your work speak that is your for, fruit. for that yourself, is your right? Fruit. Exactly. Let your work speak for it. So that's why I say if you know the artist, you did. then you, you, then know, you know my work. That's right. You that's know what I'm saying? It, you know, Justin to tell you, man, that, um, you know, at the height of the start of his career, when we were going around visiting all these different labels, I wouldn't even let that man carry his own luggage. Yeah. You know why? Because he already looked like a star day one. And I said, You're, a star doesn't carry his luggage. And he's like, that doesn't make any sense. It's just a tool. I'm like, no, you're not carrying your luggage. And, I'm a, and watch what happens. We're standing in line in Starbucks in the airport, and people are like, I don't know who you are, but I want a picture, and I want an autograph. And, and, and this is a true story. Yep. That's what's up. You know what I'm saying? Why? Because I understand the business. Mm-hmm. I understand what the consumer wants, mm-hmm. and I understand that the more that I do and the artist can just focus on being yeah, an artist, that's right. yeah. then he's gonna, he'll be able to go out there or she'll be able to go out there on stage and focus and do exactly what she does. I live and breathe this. And if we stop doing business together, if I don't work with you no more, 
you can I don't ever want somebody to be able to come back and say mm-hmm. I stopped working with him because he took money from me or or he didn't do his or best. he gave me bad advice mm-hmm. or I just didn't feel like he could give me what I want can't bad talk to people you. I, I you'll never hear that about me Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Nobody not can say the, that. Not about the company either. I mean, mm-hmm. we might not agree. We're mm-hmm. going to agree to disagree. But at the mm-hmm. end of the day, you know, we pride ourselves on not, you know, taking advantage of people mm-hmm. and misleading people. Mm-hmm. And like I said, I'm pretty straightforward yeah. to the point. Yes. He's, yeah. Crystal's brutal. I'm not brutal. You're brutal. <laughs> but no, that's I'm good, like, though. you know. So that's I'm, good for business. Cut, that's that's good business. Dry. That's just, just good business. That is good business. Very good business. Know. There's no I'm way around it. I'm not going to never tell you that the sky is pink. No. Because you said it was. No, the Or just to get your your business. I'm not going to tell you what you want to hear all the time. I'm going to tell you the truth. Right. Because that's what works. That's what works. So... Uh, that's what's and, and that's we really do pride ourselves on that. So. But I mean, you know, and in, in, in and I, I've been very fortunate to work with some great people. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, seen that. um I've seen them. you know, with you know Justin obviously, you know, I'm still working with uh I've had the pleasure of working with Fun Ghost. A lot of Amazing. people don't know who Fun Ghost is, but I, I manage Fun Ghost Fun to this Ghost. day. Funk Ghost and I were artists in in rival groups at one Hold point. Up. Funk he, used, Ghost. he used to be a part of Tap Ghost and Phobia. Dude, hold up. And so, yeah, describe those dark skin, uh, deep stature, voice. I got to see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got to see. So, um, but we we were always we were always friends, even though we were in rival groups. Okay. And he continued music as an artist, and then I went on to do the business. Business But to this day, we're we're good friends. That's what's up. And um, coming full circle. I've been a part of the creation of a lot of his projects. It's from a managerial standpoint. Okay. Um, mm-hmm. And, you know, I probably shouldn't say this on air, but it's exclusive. <laughs> oh, but, it's just him. It's just chilling. But, it's okay. you know, Ghost is back working on music again. Hey. And, uh, you know. He exclusive. And, he and I uh, think Justin James have plug. just done a, done real, a record. For real. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Funk Ghost and Think Justin James just, just did a record. I got it. Um, exclusive, exclusive, exclusive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and um, yes. you know, so and, and and so you know, and I just did a I just did a post today, man, on, on IG. My IG is uh, a yeah. DGM Life. If Who, y'all who don't are know, you? a DGM Life okay. um, on IG. Um, but I just did a post today, and I said, man, I just really like the energy that's going on in, in the Bay right now. Yeah, J. R. reposted. So it. many people. Working. Are so, working. Are yeah. working. I mean, if there's one thing that's come out of this COVID, yeah, is the work. work. I was telling him, I was telling him, even like uh, my staff, the bartenders, mm-hmm. they got their little side hustles going on. Yeah, they got Juicy. I love her it. Body, her oh, body. Framework. Framework, framework by Juicy. Yeah, by Juicy. Okay. Framework by Juicy. Exclusive. Frame, frame, framework. Exclusive. Yeah. Yeah. Fr- frame, framework by, by Juicy. juicy. Framework. Framework. By Juicy. By Juicy. Oh, yeah, shouts funny. out to Crystal Clear Faces. She hooked me up today. You know? Mm-hmm. Facts. Facts. So, yeah, so I've had the pleasure to think Justin James, Funk Ghost. Uh, so I managed him for a year. I managed Demi Nova for a year. Yeah. So when I say Good I work job. with some great talent, yeah. I work with Kalia. Of course. Lene. Kalia yeah. Lene. Mm-hmm. I managed her for a year. So, again, it's I've had the pleasure of working with some great talent. Yeah, that's real. And with when one door closes, it seems like another door continues to open. That's what I was doing. And so I, I, I continue to involve. So that's why. So you still, so you're definitely down to work with new artists. Of course. Always. I love new artists because especially. So raw, right now we're going to play a raw, song. Especially I need raw to, talent. We got to go to. Hold yeah. On, I need a song. I know a guy. Um, especially. Hey, raw talent. Have a, hey, I need, let me, let me I want you by Taylor Parks. Taylor. 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 T-A-Y-L-A. Taylor. Absolutely. Taylor. Tell you as much as you want. See, Taylor. Taylor. See, this you is that one? A lot of this I'm music we don't it. hear on everyday radio. Because if you don't got that one, I'm we'll sure go. Like There's a lot of songs in here to scroll. Let's through. go Summer Walker. <laughs> oh, I like that. Oh, Let's go Jesus. Summer Walker. Yes, Summer Walker. So I got Taylor Park. Please go. You got Taylor go Park. So you want me to do like Summer really after? Summer. We'll go Summer. In a, we'll go Summer right after. Okay. Let's go one? Taylor Parks. I want you. Okay. And then we'll go Summer Walker, and we'll figure out which one. You don't know which one. Chillers and Chillettes. Keep chilling. You already know. Think I finally got your message You won't just let me go and let you down I'm one of those bad decisions That keeps 
Changing your mind around And two is a company Three is a crowd One keeps me grounded And one in the clouds Contradicting the things I thought I knew So indecisive Don't know what to do I want you
Yes, yes, yes. We are back. As we just just chill. Just chill. Just chill it. Just chill 53. This is episode 53. This is episode 53. My dog, Just Henry, gets busy. <laughs> Word up. That's what she said. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's the Word fuck. up. Oh, that red alert. You guys are nuts. Oh. Guys are nuts. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. So, uh, my good sir, on with the news, if you don't mind. But of course. But of course. Johnson and Johnson. Yes, we be. Reaches a deal with the United States for 100 million doses of coronavirus vaccine at more than one billion dollars. Mm. <laughs> yes. The experimental vaccine is currently in early stage human trials and is expected to begin late stage human trials in September. Uh, the deal gives the United States the option to order an additional 200 million doses as well. Johnson & Johnson got $456 million Don't trust to develop this vaccine earlier oh this year. Johnson & Johnson is one of the handful of companies who have reached a deal with the United States to supply vaccine after federal approval. Companies such as Sanofi, S-A-N-O-F-I, uh, GlaxoSmithKline, the, is it Pfizer? P F I Z E R Pfizer yep. and BioNTech. I'm going to say BioNTech. B I O N T E C H. BioNTech. Anyway, pay attention to your stocks, ladies and germs, chillers and chillettes. That's what these guys are about. That's where the money is. The bottom line. I don't care. What you know about it? Oh, uh, oh, oh, excuse me. You would know about these things. I forgot. You've got okay. got a degree in these types of degree. types of talks, yeah? True. All right. Explosive. There it goes, love. Yes. Explosive. 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 Listen. Whenever I hear I'm doing it. <laughs> I know. She's got you all the battery right now. She got I you with a hand trigger. Listen, I love Listen, you know, Crystal used to be on radio in Philly, so she's at she home said, in front of the microphone. Yeah. Don't, don't get it. Well, she got the voice. You can tell when she came yeah. in. I was like, okay. Twisted. Didn't even know she, she came was in and even she didn't even choke up at all. Nah. Oh. She came nervous, in and said, you know what? I know where to command my space. Never that. Mm-mm-mm. Did you get to work with Jazzy Joe? How was it? How was it? How was it? He's sickening with it. Yeah. Oh, and I just seen sickening. Tap Money on an unsung episode. You did? Yeah. I didn't realize That's that. My was like That's my favorite. That's one of my favorite shows. Yeah, yeah I, I didn't realize that he was a tour DJ. DJ Cash Money? <laughs> nah, I haven't seen that one. That's one of my favorite shows by far. But of course. But of course. On with the news. Ha ha. We have but of course. Tell me, Philly got the heat. Yeah, they do. Philly got the but heat. in this case, first Michigan residents Uh-oh. get experimental COVID-19 vaccine. More volunteers are being sought. Would you volunteer? Negative. Would you volunteer? Mm. Mm. I don't even take the flu shots. No, I don't me either. either. <laughs> me either. <laughs> and no. I'm doing good. I'm doing yeah, real good. I, I know more people get sick. a whole bunch of water. From, yeah, you get a flu shot and you get sick immediately. immediately. I fought, I fought, I fought that, for a thanks. year to get one and they, they forced me to get one. Did no. you get nah. sick? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. He's, saying, he's saying that to stay on the network. Yeah. I, like, I get it. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, I get it. Yeah. Yeah. But I, but I, yeah, nah, get it, we know better. I'm not get it. We know better. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Maybe in my twenties, but yeah, nah, nah, I'm not. We know better no. now. No, I think the Navy. Thank you. No, you were in the Navy. Yes, I was. Oh my god. Yes, five and a half, almost six Where years. Where were you stationed? Uh, Norfolk, Virginia. I lived there too. Outstanding. Outstanding. I applaud your lack of claustrophobia. What's, What's that? I applaud your lack of claustrophobia. Oh, Hampton nah. Rolls. Okay. <laughs> wow. Terminal Boulevard. Yes. <laughs> I used to stay. Um, I stayed in Hampton. I also mm-hmm. stayed in Ocean View, right there near oh, the base. In Norfolk. Yeah, yeah, and I used to stay in, and then mm-hmm. I little Virginia Beach time. Mm-hmm. That was a tumultuous I, time. Tumultuous. What year were you? That was with a lady. I yeah. love this yeah. this word. It's, <laughs> it's amazing. What was your uh, your rate? Your I was an EM electrician's really? mate. Okay. I was in a nuclear power program. Awesome. Yeah. So, you on know, ships? Uh, a- aircraft carrier. Oh. No submarines for okay, this guy. What ship were you on? Uh, Harry S. Truman. Okay. CVN seventy five. So, so, how do you feel about that explosion? That just explosion happened? in we Beirut. About that. Yes. Oh, we talked about it. I, honestly, I my one part of me is feeling foul play, but the other 
It's just there's not enough information to 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 deduce correctly yet. You know what it is when you see it at this point. But it's it's an amazing. We want to be sight. nice and be like, yeah, maybe it was an it's accident. An, it's an awe inspiring sight. No like it's it's a crazy sight. Like it's because sad. it's sad, but the power, bro. Yeah, the power. Right. I'm I was like, just thinking about all the people in there. In there, can six you imagine shut, all the people just sitting in the bathroom, it. and all of a sudden, boom, your whole house blows up. Everything. Everything. It's crazy to me. I'm like, yo, that's nuts. Everything. I was not. I was not ready house. for that clip. It was only sixty seconds. Yeah. I, so I can't even imagine being in bro. in it. in the vicinity. Yeah. Like when I mean, it I seen them. I seen footage of some dude sitting on a jet ski filming it. Wow. Like filming it, sitting on a jet ski. I seen that footage coming. Yeah. And I'm like, you're in the middle of the ocean, and you felt it that far. Yeah. I would be That's a little shook. Shock wave. Shock wave breaking the sound barrier. As it's expanding, like yeah. this, is, this is crazy, <laughs> crazy to watch, crazy. So, so sad. Yep, praying for him, praying yeah. for him, praying for him. Uh, let's take a moment from the news. Stir it. This is what we're gonna do because this is the actual first show of August. Yay! Oh. Yay! All right. So August fifth, two thousand twenty. We're just gonna. We're just gonna, what do you say? Entanglement. Oh, <laughs> is that new song. This, that wow. is a new song. Is this, that is a new wow. song. Is this entanglement? Wow. It is August. Yeah. Is Somebody August. say August. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they had a wonderful picture of uh, Jada Jada. Jada. So doing that. Funny. That was funny. Yeah. I thought that was hilarious. August got here oh, real quick. Will. Real quick. Right after the red Poor table. Will. Oh man. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, but nonetheless, without. <laughs> For the contrast. The, the Hamiltons did a really good job of singing a song about entanglement. That was really good. Well, the, yeah, the, it's that only on rightfully YouTube. so because, I mean, so many people, so only so many songs about coronavirus can, can be put out. So, therefore, I think entanglement was right yeah. uh, right up the right alley. Absolutely. It was the right timing. You know, yes. If you're up on it like that, you know? <coughs> yeah, you got to be. Some people Listen. are. Not me. <laughs> oh, I'm a daddy. Too late. Too late. I'm just hitting. Anyway, it is. Admit your happy month. Can you admit you're happy? I'm very happy. The way you came Thank in, you was I'm, elated. I love it. I was cloud nine. That's what I'm talking about. She's glowing. I'm glowing. <laughs> I'm glowing, everybody. She's glowing. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder why. I'll tell you later. That's what's up. On the next episode of. On the next episode. As she comes back on right. a later date. Which... And I'll tell you why. All about him. Oh. It. Mm. Mm. It not yeah. It's okay. Oh, we're yeah. talking about the dolphins you were posting the other day, oh, right? Uh, oh yeah, and I, I pulled up in the parking lot and noticed that uh the the new whip came out for the for the drive over. Ooh. I was like, Oh, little blue had to stay home. Okay. Since the baby bad video is out now, we, got we're, options. we had to upgrade. We got options. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah to the, the, new, the, the new the new version of the new whip. <laughs> well, and what 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 is this new whip? The brand? Can I just get the brand? Is it oh, it's all. Awesome. She's a Mercedes person. Outstanding. Yeah, she's a Mercedes. She just yeah. spaceships. Okay, she just went up on wheels. She just went way up. That's what's up. I'm all like all the way up. <laughs> hey, we ain't gonna ask the class. I'm like, I will say this. Wow, I drove in an M class one time. Mm. And it was the it was the M I don't know it's five hundred horsepower type joint, Ooh. and Ooh. we escaped the police that night. <laughs> I did that the other night. No, you didn't. Don't mm-hmm. say that. Okay. Not on this show. Uh-oh. Not on this show. Uh-oh. You went from the police. Statue of limitations still. Up. No, I wasn't on the police. What had happened was oh. <laughs> this isn't this isn't a what is it? This isn't a blue friendly radio station. But how y'all doing? <laughs> <laughs> I'm only kidding. But it's like you don't look not like her. You no, stop. Was, no, no. You better stop. No. You smell better too. Thank anyway, you. um, it is Black Business Month, so Yay. shout out to Black owned businesses in the building. Woo! You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the black owned businesses in the building. We've got a lot of black owners yes. in Support the building. Your yes. This, is, this yes. is a room full of black owners, B-O-B's. except Sergio right now. Sergio. But he's got melanin Sergio, in his skin. Sergio, you got melanin. Exclusive B- melanin. Got melanin. Exclusive. Listen, Exclusive. BBM. Black businesses matter. 
Big Black businesses, M. Black businesses matter. matter. Mm-hmm. That's right. And it's all about this month. And this isn't a short month either. Mm. How does this month longer than February? Anyway, yeah. we're not going to go there. Child Support Awareness Month. <laughs> really? Oh, wow. Really? <laughs> you, need awareness? you need awareness for that? I love it. I love it. <laughs> Real talk. I love it. On the internet, you know, the World Wide Web. The Support interwebs. your child. <laughs> they just put a snap and say this is a <laughs> As long as you child pay. Support. It's not a holiday. <laughs> It is a, to, to bring a, awareness a to bring awareness to all the programs provided by the child support system. Oh, oh, is it the programs? Is or is it they the know. people <laughs> that are... They know they're going to pay their money. They, yeah, when they, right. they, they, they know. Not the arrest <laughs> program. Not the take your license away program. Oh, not the uh, uh, garnishing your wages Garnish your program. Wages We're not on program. that side of the program. Yeah, We're talking... Because that funds... Side that helps funds the program. Yeah, We're talking about the wonderful stuff. Huh? Are we... Are anybody aware of your child support? Am I aware of it? Are anybody aware of your child support? Child support month thing, stuff like that? You don't, I, uh, you don't have to be aware my, when, my you're, kid's mother when you're when you're active. When you're active, I'm active. Aware. When you're active, I'm definitely aware. I feel it's, it. it's it's the non-active people that need to be aware. See what I mean? Of well, the programs, yes. The of the programs, yes. That they are defunding mm. by not funding. By not funding the program. The program. Mm. The exclusive. Program. Get a part of something. Hey, man, wow. that'd be funny. This is wow. All right, next holiday. I'm gonna <laughs> Children's <laughs> Vision and Learning Month. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. 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 We just had uh shout out to Flavors Water Ice and uh Enhance the Chance. We just had the back to school bash, uh I think it was last Saturday, and we gave a bunch of backpacks away, gave really? a bunch of clothes away, we gave a bunch of food away, drinks, we had a bunch of artists come out there and perform. It was actually pretty interesting. So when you do things like that and you mm-hmm. get involved like that, you have to always, always invite Crystal Clear. We would love to do partner and do Facts. things like definitely i would definitely reach there, out you know what yeah. I, I do have to Understood. come in tampa there's a lot of them out here in tampa yeah man do that. yeah um, man and it was actually um quite awesome because this is the third year i've been a part of it and it's always growing and it's just good to see the kids and then you actually see repeats of kids too sometimes so you get them mm-hmm. see them grown mm-hmm. and it's like oh woo 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 then i try to sing a song that's not too crazy so it's like pg-13 pg is and then it, we keep it going. Is there any of that out there? For me, yes, yeah, a lot. Yeah. You know, it's just certain curse words. Some of my guest artists, some my features uh, okay. are on my songs. On your, on your music. Yeah, yeah like, okay. For me, it's because there's a bunch of babies out here. Babies, the baby, it baby, bit. him over there, hey. the baby, That's right. big yeah, baby, yeah, little yeah, baby, yeah, yeah. her right. baby, baby mama, baby mama, baby it's baby. Over. baby. Listen, MC so, baby, if you on the baby, a rapper, just put baby and then figure out what you want to put in front. Right, could be your zodiac I'm his baby. Could be baby. Capricorn baby. Aquarius, oh, I'm Capricorn baby. Aquarius baby. Baby. Yes. I think Capricorn. they would. Cat. They would. What, what, what's your birthday? January 5th. I'll be 50. Yeah. January 12th. What? 50. There's, There's no baby. way. Woo, yes. What the fuck? Wow. I knew I liked you. She got you. good jeans. She's a, she's she got some good jeans. Yeah, top of the month. 50? Top of the year. No yes. way. I'yes. I'm so looking no forward to it. No way. She's lying. We're going to need ID. I'm not lying. She's 26. We're going to need ID. 26 My forever. daughter's 28. I don't believe How's that you. So? I don't believe just, you. I just saw her graduate from college last year. <laughs> okay. That is so funny. <laughs> That's fantastic. Yeah, you know she, I, like I thought it was. Like, When's your birthday? 23rd of January. So I know I liked you too. I'm the greatest. One, two, three. That's okay. You still in January. Are you 50 yet? Listen, no. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. You yeah. gotta catch up. Nah, oh, nah, no, no. He's like, I'm gonna pace myself. No, no, I'm pacing myself. Mm-hmm. I, I've, I've earned all the years that I've been on the planet, but I'm not quite fifty yet. Yeah. Good. You almost I'm, I'm getting, getting there. I'm you, catching you, you, up. You, you That's what's up. Too far behind. You know, right. It's no worries. I'm, I'm knocking off fifty. Pace yourself, store. brother. Yeah. It's the remix. It is also right, right, right. Exclusive. Listen. Yo, I will hashtag remix anything. Like, that's hey, real. Man. That's real. Yeah, yeah, that's the yeah, game now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bad. Yeah. Let me stop. <laughs> um, learn Japanese month. Uh-oh. I'm oh, going okay. to learn Japanese all my life. It's going to happen before. I'm, I'm going to Japan. I think that's Japanese. I want to go to Japan I'm so going. bad. Or is that China? I'm so good. I want to get, I wanna get my own samurai sword like made. I want to stay there a month mm. and watch it be made. They can do that? Yeah. Oh, in, the, in, in this century? Amazing. 
Why wouldn't they be able to? Like, they, don't they still I've have? I've seen a lot of 16th have? century like sword making movies and stuff, but I've never seen people like, that a, make them still. They still do. You probably have I to go know. out to the country. For but either way, that's cool. Happen. Now, do you get the samurai know. and the little joint that goes um, along with it? Dagger with I'm it, a like, Lord the of the Rings. Sword. Watch yeah. I don't know. swords being made in a movie type guy. If anything, oh. I'd probably be like One Piece, where you know Zoro. He's got the he's the he got three swords. He has two in each hand, one in each hand, and has one in his mouth, and he fights with the three sword style. Just like that, uh, I probably wouldn't do that though. Just chilling, radio listeners. We now know what to get. Just Henry. Anything yeah. geeky for his birthday. For his Samurai. birthday. Yes. Anything geeky. Yes. Anything Send it geeky. to PO Box. Uh, JustHenry.com. Just Henry. See, that makes yeah. so much sense right. that that doesn't yeah. exist. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're gonna create it for you. Brand it. We know all about it. you, bro. <laughs> Oh, He's like notating Look, this right let's now. Let's get our cut to you. Buying it right now. Please, let's get Dot com. Dot Dot biz. Dot biz. org. All of the above. <laughs> yes. You know, and then we'll sell it back to you we'll for to you. a nominal fee. Yeah. You know, you fam. You take Hold it. up, y'all. How you go make me... Listen. Like you go, you just business. You just you Listen, sold we, me. Listen. Then you sold me out like in the, in the same sentence. Like it was... I, I, honestly, just what we did was, since we helped you f- to become the better version of you, <laughs> keep going. We protected you from somebody else stealing the idea. idea. Mm, yeah. Bam! It's closer. Mm-hmm. So that when you're ready to step up <laughs> and absorb it. the I idea, heard, I heard that mm. CCMC mm. got Preach. you back. What? Oh. Stamped That's it. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. Stamped it. That's it. Ideas don't float in the air around us. No, they're formulated. They they're are. formulated. Yeah, I get and, it. And we abs- and and then you absorb them. <coughs> oh, I overstand <laughs> shit, a lot sorry. of what's going on right now. <laughs> I hope y'all understand <laughs> where I'm going with this whole night right now. That's all I'm saying. At the end of this show, y'all Holler gonna find at, out. Holler at us. That's it. Crystal clear. We no, I don't trade. have to holler at you. I just speak clearly. We will trademark you. patent crystal and clear. Copyright something so what? fast. By the end of the conversation, you'll be like, "So what basically, the heck all the stuff that's been holding a brother back." Right. I already understand that you guys are more than capable, but we will continue with my show because y'all ain't gonna take over my show. <laughs> I think you're trying today. to tell us no, that's don't not what that is. That that's not what that not. is. No, 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 it was no. a kind segue. I don't, I don't do very, abrupt, very disrespectful segue. Yeah, because no. he broke it down with me when he told me to shut up. He told me how. He yeah. nice it was a nice way of saying I got the, I got and, the and wheel. I, and I followed the I got the wheel, bro. Yeah, I followed directions. <laughs> that's all that was. Yes. What is the SEO for With the, Just Henry? Let me do that right now. What is SEO? While you're doing your your business, okay. back to your show, we will make sure that your search engine optimization of Just Henry is... That's a very good acronym. So, if y'all won't see me cry right now, right? Like, because nobody talked to me like that. No, nobody talked to me like that no more. You know what I'm saying? It's okay. Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> no, I, I what think month I, is it? What month is it? We got to do another month. At the end of the day, your show is providing a platform and yes. awareness for Crystal Clear Management and Consulting. So I think it's only right that we sprinkle, sprinkle a little bit, some knowledge in between. It's 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 welcome, gracious. So since we're on your show, there's no charge. But I just think that it's it's important. Just so we have knowledge of what is. you have the knowledge. And so you can see right here that just in two seconds, I'm literally going to tell you how to do the appropriate search engine optimization on Just Henry. But go back to your show. No worries. I will. It is also Mushroom Month. Mushrooms. Yeah. Our last guest, Nikolai the Poet. Uh, he's actually a, a, a connoisseur of mushrooms yes. of sorts. He okay. likes to eat mushrooms because he's a vegan. Okay. And so um, okay. mushrooms are very meaty, so to speak, as yeah. far as vegetables uh, and being, well, not vegetables, excuse me, uh, fungi, fungi, so that you'd be able to consume and be sustained. And, you know, they get flavors. They do all kinds of stuff. So I did a little research, right? So uh, common mushrooms are like the button, cremini, and portobello mushrooms. Mm-hmm. Somewhat uncommon, the king oyster, the chanterelle, the black trumpet mushroom, and most notarized, the enoki, popular in Asian cuisine, such as uh, the shiitake mushroom and mm-hmm. lion's 
Mane. Lion's mane. We brought that up. It's good for your brain. Mm. Yes. Shout out to Cactus brain. Hat Mushrooms. Cactus Hat Mushrooms out of Tampa. Tampa, right? Yep. Tampa. They One actually. My homies runs that. They, they do grow mushrooms. All the mushrooms. All of the fungi that you. Everything can that he mentioned, they got. They got them. What's the name of it? Cactus Hat Mushrooms. Cactus Hat. You mushrooms. should see these things. They're pink and blue, and the Beautiful. the the lion's mane one is like a big. It's just like it looks like a big ball of fur. It's crazy, but Saint said it's the best food for your brain. Yes, really. Yes. Yep. The way Amazing. God. I believe in God, so the way God has set it all up for everybody to just be able to and prepare it correctly mm. and then be able to uh, not only enjoy it because we're mm. human, we like good good food, but also to be able to like make your body enriched and, and, and build something. Like you're rebuilding your brain. You're rebuilding, um, what is it, say? brain cells is what he said. Yeah. So I was like, okay, oh, I can get better at what? Everything? Okay. Limitless. Let's do this. Eat some mushrooms. I'm gonna have to try some. I, I'm not a fan of mushrooms, but I might just. Well, eat see, it. is the thing you you're yeah. used to. You used to plain Jane. Yeah, Portobello exactly. Mushrooms. Or the just small ones that come on pizza. The rubbery. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Those are portobello. Yeah. Those are usually portobello. Or the crimin. Not even the crimin. The portobello. Because the portobello boys, you gotta cut them in half and yeah, slice yeah. them, slice them, slice them, and then they look good. And that's the common boys. But nonetheless, it is mushroom month. Bam! Sure. Family Meals Month! Yay. Huh? Facts. This is a good month. Family should actually make it a point to detach from the world and spend time together. Uh, you gotta check in with each other, you know what I mean? That litmus test. You gotta see who who's going through what, mm-hmm. see who needs help. Yes. This is bonding. This is important. It's actual, it's an actual lost art. How do you feel about uh, the, the, the matter of fact, Pardon me, my good sir. I don't, no, no offense, because it's, it was just at the moment. But my dear, madam, how do you feel about the importance of family meal time in the black home? Let's just start there. It's very important. Do you, oh. think it's, do you think it's prevalent? Do you think it's prevalent enough right now? Prevalent enough meaning? Do you think it's a, at the forefront of fa- black homes right now? No. Okay. It's not. And what do you think? Well, how, what is that causing? It's causing friction, tension. It's mm-hmm. causing a displace, uh, displacement. Um, mm-hmm. We don't know each other anymore. Mm-hmm. We're not talking. Mm-hmm. Everything is social media. Everything mm-hmm. is a telephone. Mm-hmm. So it's it's horrible in a home. Yeah, that's um, real. It, it just is. And it's, it's, it's unfortunate that, you know, I see sometimes if, I'm, if we're out to dinner or if we're just somewhere and you have a couple mm-hmm. and out to dinner. Yeah. They're sitting there texting. Um. Back commenting, it, commenting on the stupid. food we just uh, took a picture media, of. Social media, taking pictures. Like, <laughs> there's no intimacy there. Right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's I just, not, it's, it's just not good. For and now that relationship's picture. suffering yeah. later on, and then they're just saying, you know what? Let's solve this relationship issue. Let's have a kid. That's not what you that want to do. That, that doesn't. You mean that doesn't work? No. <laughs> no. You get some amazing people out of it. Jason Dory, love you. Yeah. Uh, you get some great food porn for IG. Hey. That's it. <laughs> I've never been to that restaurant and you just took a picture. I might go. I appreciate it, but at sacrifice of you being able to have a conversation. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So you're going to go there and eat. That's, 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 and to me, it's worth it because I'm not in the midst of that relationship nor yeah. conversation. So. I appreciate this side of it. Yes. But I understand what you're saying. Yes. But at the end of the day, you guys don't know each other. Their kids are so out of at, at home, mm-hmm. out of focus, out of touch. Mm-hmm. It's pretty. And it's it's pretty sickening to me now because all the the kids are like I said, so in tune with social media and and what is it Xbox or PlayStation? PlayStation. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They don't go outside and play Not anymore. They don't do anything. My daughter walked outside. I was like, ugh. Come right. right out here. It's like yeah. squinting. Like, this right. is. Right. Like, <laughs> like she just left the cave. Disgusted <laughs> by the sun. Like, what is that? What is you this? need some sun. Yeah. I'm you like, need some vitamin D. <laughs> <laughs> just don't the do question, anything. The question that I have, though, is these are the same kids that complain that they're stuck in the house because of COVID. Yeah. But you don't go outside go when school. there isn't COVID. Exactly. Go back to school. So. Because you don't want to be told you have to stay, do anything. You don't, you're so, not going to so, tell so me I'm going to stay home. Go outside to go inside someplace? No, it's, I think it's the school social, the social aspect that I, they miss. Because my son, 
Yeah, I get that. Just went to one year. He was in kindergarten. He's like, Daddy, I won't go back to school. Mm. Like, what? You want a what, son? I mean, I know we we've, we haven't really stopped teaching you things throughout the summer because I'm an awesome daddy like that. He has an awesome grandma like that, too. Thank you, Mommy. Mm-hmm. Um, but it's it's... It's amazing to see him really like grasp to the fact that there's a there's something missing, Daddy, um, and you can't you don't play with me like like other kids play with me, and I I, I love you, Daddy, but uh, can I go back to school, please? Right. And now me as a daddy, I have to look at this uh, from a standpoint of do I want to please my son or right. do I want to keep my son alive? Or oh, we're going to keep this young man alive. Right. Because mm-hmm. right. he's going to do great things. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's it. So, therefore, I'm I'm, I'm a little caught uh, in this whole back to school thing. Conflict. Conflicted. Uh, mainly because I agree with the whole stay at home thing. I know it's an inconvenience to a lot of people. Mainly those that actually work a lot. Mm-hmm. Long hours during the day. Mm-hmm. So, I understand that that can be an inconvenience to be at, have them at the house. But... One, the city provides them laptops mm-hmm. so that they can do this at the house. The mm-hmm. only thing you would have to do is either pay for in, uh, uh, internet mm-hmm. or tap into somebody else's internet. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Get that password. Yeah, that we're, password. Not, we're not condoning that one. Password. I'm just saying. I saw an, school, 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 school. I, I saw an interesting school, post today that said that uh, 90s parents did not complain about having to leave the kids. No, nah, really didn't. For an extended period of time while they went to work. Mm. And so it, it put, gave me some perspective because I'm saying to myself, but in, th- in today's climate, mm-hmm. people are having kids at 17, 18 mm. years old. Mm-hmm. And then their kids are having kids at 17, 18 years old. Mm-hmm. So now the grandma huh. still out clubbing. is still working. Yeah, hasn't even hit uh, Social it's not, Security. It's not, it's not like it used to be when I was a kid. You could go to Grandma's house after school, yeah. mm-hmm. and, and she, she watched my cousins. Because my mom retired, you know, right? But the grandmas of this generation are still, still young enough to where they're clubbing. Mm-hmm. They're, they're going to the jazz house. <laughs> hey. yeah, facts. I mean, it's they it are. Hey, you know, they're right. still working, Pick up so something. they can't be right. available. To watch the kids, yeah. so the parents are using school, yeah, as a babysitter. As a babysitter, right. you see what I'm saying? And so, the, and I got the, my the son complaint kids, in this generation like is, I need school to babysit so I can work, you which is ridiculous. Know. But you don't. My mom's a teacher, so I'm a firm believer in the fact that a parent need, oh, excuse me, parents need to be parents. For the home aspect of everything right. so that you can make sure that this child knows how to act right. before, before they get, they to, get to school. Because right. Right. when they get to school, guess what my mom has to do? Oh, come on. Mm-hmm. Come on. I can't spank you like I do my children. Mm-hmm. So please sit down. Right. Please sit down. Come on now. I'm going to have to hold. I got to gotta take away a, or I got to punish you and, and uh, take away, um, what is it, privileges and blah, 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 blah. I'm going to put a little sticker with a sad face on your day. And, uh-huh. then, and then to work in conjunction or in concert with the teachers. True. So what is being taught at, at school and then the homework that comes home, inspect the homework. In fact, so, are you in this so teacher's face? In, in, in to continue to promote and mm-hmm. push what is being learned so mm-hmm. that the, the, the kid is not on their own just doing the homework. Right. They're still, you know, you have to re, especially the younger the kids are, you have to reinforce it. Yeah. Right. Need support. Teachers teaching how to write. Then you should be sitting there trying to help them how to write too. So that the, t- together it works in concert, but right? People are more concerned about kids going to they were school they as more a worried they more worried about their social media right. than their children. Right? They ready to get some likes than their children actually right. learning how to read and write. Right? And that rhymed. I didn't even mean to. Oh, bark! Ah, you know the singer, the singer you becomes a rapper. But for yeah. real though, it's like it's like it's the bane of our existence right now. Like this is what's dragging us down. And, co- and companies are being more flexible now too, with with the fact that okay, you're doing meetings or conferences mm-hmm. on Zoom and stuff like that. They know your kids are there. So the kids might actually walk in, walk the in camera. on the meeting. Yeah. Okay, so great. they don't look that's at it like the culture uh, we're in now. Mm-hmm. So I mean, I think that's you know, a good and thing. Again, I can't speak for everybody and what you do. Yeah, no, not with me. I work in banking, point. so no, yeah. no, no. I'm not gonna point the no, finger. I can't you know see. Can't nobody see that. 
But mm-hmm. yeah, I think it's an it's an interesting climate. Nobody get it. But for the sake of keeping the kids safe. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah it, I, it's wanted, I wanted it at the house because this it's going to cost the state too much money to be able to keep up with. Because you're going to need extra nurses. You're going to need extra people to facilitate the actual checking of of these temperatures as these kids come in and out of the school. Because if that's not what you're doing, then you're messing up. Because if you're not checking every child every day, every time that they come up to this door, you are messing up. Because somebody's going to slip through. Because I used to work security, and I I knew the dude that uh, patted everybody down. But guess what? Somebody he wasn't patting her. everybody down no. as, as 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 wonderfully as he was doing some people. So therefore, comma something got in, and guess what I got to do? Mm-hmm. Well, I was a bouncer then. I'm a daddy now. Anyway, <laughs> but yeah, but you get what I'm saying. Like it's just uh, frustrating. I wish I had a way to to police all those things, such as like um, my my disgruntled feelings of people that break the. The, the 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 dry the laws on the road laws of the road like like you know how people just cut across or they'll no be turn in the turning signal. lane and then, like do some obscene stuff through the innocent <sighs> I'm like I really wish a, a, a law enforcement officer was right here to witness this <clears throat> I don't have a dash cam <laughs> and am I a Takashi you know what I'm saying do you want to do, you want to do that though am I a Takashi do you want to have that on your rep do I need all those colors. <laughs> Crazy. Just chilling radio exclusive. Exclusive. Oh, exclusive. Ah! exclusive. <laughs> he's so ready for that. Yep. Uh, All right. It. it is foot heel month. Excuse me, foot health month. Oh, I said heel. Okay. Facts. Foot Facts. health month. Facts. Pedicures. Love them. Uh, podiatrists. Need them. Right? Straight up. I'm going to need y'all to... Uh, Please don't chill on those bunions, those corns, or hammer toes. Please. No, no. Take care of those quickly. Yes, Women, indeed. take your man to get a pedicure. Yes. Visit your local podiatrist. Matter of fact, shout out to Dr. Ebony out of Orange, California. What? From the TLC the TV. show, that's my show. From the TV <laughs> show, uh, My Feet Are something? Killing Me. My Feet Are Killing Me. You don't watch that? Oh, She's so gorgeous. She's so that pretty, one. yes. She's so beautiful with... Absolutely no makeup. I, I, I don't, I don't she is in gorgeous. Googling I, I don't, right I don't, now. I don't care how beautiful she is. I want this. Does she know what she's doing? Yes. She takes care of people's feet that come Nasty, in there looking ugly, like aliens. Black oh. toes. And, and they come back look, and then they listen. finish looking like human beings at the end. Listen. What's the name of the show again? My Feet My Are feet Killing, killing me. me. I'm Googling I'm, it right I'm, now. I'm definitely going to She's Google gorgeous. It oh, I got right it on now. DVR. Yeah, she is. And I, follow, I hate feet, though, I so I can't. I can't. I can't. I don't care how pretty the girls. I can't watch the show about. Listen, feet, I can't man. believe she touches those nasty feet. <laughs> I can't. That's I can't deal thing. with. Yes. You should see the uh, thick. You should have seen the thick black gloves yes. she wears. Though. Man, she is pretty. Bro. She's she gorgeous. Is gorgeous. Mm-hmm. The teeth are, are those up? eyes yeah. green. Or she got green She's eyes. Beautiful. TLC. I'm definitely. No, I think there's context. Out. Okay. Look, man. I'm, when you take when, you, when your mercy. feet are on point and your feet mm-hmm. feel good, your whole body feel good. Yeah, because it lines up everything. So seriously, I mean, I'm look. Seriously. Like I said, I'm just promoting it. Ugh. Bruz, if y'all got a problem with me saying oh, this. Ah! Bruz, if y'all got a problem Sergio's with me saying this, it is what it is. But women, what it is. take your man, mm-hmm. punk your man, Get a pedicure. treat your man to a Ooh. pedicure. Ooh. Yes. I don't care how macho. Especially how, how rough them heels get. Listen. Let them let know. Otherwise, if he cuts up your sheets at night. That's and your, your legs. <laughs> he's shaving your legs in the sleep. No. Nah, that ain't what you want. Or using his toes to scratch the back of his calves. Oh. That's that's and her <laughs> and leaving that ashy trail. I feel a little you know, tense like, right now. Really I don't know. I don't know if this feels right now. I'm just saying. You feel, you feel, I feel suspect right now. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's me. Sergio, let me see your feet. Ah uh, no no, I hate feet. I hate feet. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Feet under wraps. That is not a secret. <laughs> I'm gonna make a T-shirt that says "I hate feet." Don't show me them. Don't show me. Don't show Take me care of your feet. Your feet. Also. National Goat Cheese Month. Uh, goat not cheese. bad. Goat cheese is not bad. Goat cheese. I'm saying national. I don't know where you find the stuff, Rico. I have no well, idea. I mean, <laughs> we, yes, goat cheese, goat cheese goat cheese is good though. It's not bad. Goat cheese is good. Especially it's clean goat. Is it better than clean regular goat. milk? Clean goat. Okay. Okay. I mean, I don't Isn't like goat, goat cheese as much as I like feta cheese. Uh, as far as health wise, yeah, that's yes. what I was always heard. It's different. Also, it is National Peach Month. I brought in some peaches. Oh. Anybody want some peaches? Peaches. Anybody? I'm, I'm, I'm mad at you. The Georgia peach? 
I'll take it. Where they on sale because of the month? I'm just saying, we got peaches. Oh, you mean so, the pre cut uh, joints? Well, yeah. I mean, I couldn't get, I couldn't get, no, and you get the juice in the water. water? In the juice. juice. Natural juice. juice. Oh, okay. Why would you have peaches in water? No, I just, I'm just they have saying. Two, like, they, no, they, they, no, not, not one. They, they bottle them different. No, they have the juice or they just right, have water. That's right, they do have the this juice, but then sometimes yes. they have the syrup. And yeah, the syrup, syrup is what's not really good. No, yeah. not syrup. This is 100% juice. Gotcha. Yes. I love peaches and cream. Yeah. Yes. Peaches and okay, 112. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Taking the history <laughs> lesson out of music. It is also Romance Awareness Month. Mm-hmm. Holler. Well, that would be the Valentine holiday itself. Oh, single awareness month is the damn Wonderful. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. There right, you sorry. go. We are closing and in And we on did talk day. about that. Um, What will be your legacy month? Boom. Mm. Matter of fact, uh, Crystal, speak on it. What will be your legacy? My legacy, let's see. My legacy would be that I have, um, you know what? What was that? Breast cancer. Is that Survival? my legacy? That's, that's no, you. Beating, it's like beating a it and being an advocate. Yeah. For that, you. that was right. Being it and being an advocate for you, but well, add that to the list. Well, that is definitely on the top yeah, of the list. Make because her choose her own. This is the thank, you. Her thank you. Thank you. I'm, I'm just saying. saying I'm, 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 but, it, but I'm just saying that. <laughs> not listen, that. Listen, not that breast cancer wouldn't be. And it is, and it is actually number one. He's right, but I was going somewhere else with that. But anyway, I'm gonna get back to that. But yes, <laughs> breast cancer survivor, definitely. Um, I'm, I'm definitely an advocate. You want to talk to me? No, I was about to say we could go to the business. We could go to the bi- Thank you. businesses. Thank oh, yeah. We could right. go with that. We are a college graduate. Yes. We are a, a mother. Yes. Uh, a mother of how many? Actually, her, her, I have two children. Her list can go on. My list can go on, but I'm, I'm gonna tell you, man. See, he wanted to talk for me. Okay, I, that's you what asked I, him that's to. What but I now pay, he's no, but that's what I pay him to do. So go yeah, ahead. They, go, oh, speak. No, go ahead. Go ahead. No, no, please, by all means. <laughs> she just got a laundry. She got a laundry list of things that that she she's living in her legacy. You know that's what's up. And I don't think the story is 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 it's been completely written yet. She's Very got well a said. lot more. To a, that she's gotten the works to accomplish. You think well, it's a movie? I'm just giving you a compliment. That's you think it. it's a movie? You think it's movie worthy? Could be. I, I think, I think it's is. documentary worthy. You think I should call my brother and a little plug in? I, I definitely think so, yeah. I think Shout Netflix. Out to Jamal I think Hill. we get this Netflix money. Listen, this is how this, this, this is how ideas work. Yeah, that's real. Here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. My Jamal, Jamal, Jamal. 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 Get, get on the movie, man. Get the script Jamal, together. Out there saying? in LA. I'll play janitor. It's okay. Right. All I, all I know is that all I know is that Miko needs to be a part of it. I think that'd be a good, a good Matter platform. Matter of fact, Miko, as long as she I think that's a good platform. Listen. You're not kind of controlling. Well, I mean, her, oh, no, 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 no. He is a crystal listen, advocate. With her brother <laughs> in the and driver's you? seat, yeah. she's in good hands. From, that's what's up. Jamal Hill is a, a Hollywood producer, director, writer. Um, he's worked. Well, actually, I am Legend. A slew of Will Smith's movies. He has uh, Brotherly Love. Okay. Deuces. Okay. Google him. That's my little brother. I'm just trying to make sure Miko gets, <laughs> gets, gets, gets the plug. That's all. Who? That's really Jamal? what's up. Both of them. I'm, I'm, Miko I'm and just Jamal. trying to get. Miko? Yeah. yeah. We going to just. No. We, we. Miko already locked in on the hub. Yeah. She, was, she, was, she already said, mm, Miko's here. All right. Yeah. It is also Green Peppers Day. Oh. I like oh, Green Peppers. peppers is- Matched That's for any like saute, green, green bread, any saute, in the same day. That is true. Oh, there it is. In a potato salad? But actually, if you get a nice saute, if you get a nice saute, Ooh. right? Like, and hey, watch this, watch this. Get a nice saute. Yeah. Get a pork loin, right? Yeah. Split the pork loin, pork spread it out. You got to pound it, pound it, pound it, pound it, pound it, pound it to make it kind of flat. Then you take the goat cheese Ooh. and you smear Go that ahead, all chef. over, right? But some people actually season their goat cheese. Words like right. smear you know just make saying? your mouth water, don't you? Right, <laughs> because you know what that thick that layer is, is going to be of that goat cheese. Yeah. In order to smear goat cheese, it has to be thick. They so go, therefore, come. We got this season. Cactus mushrooms. Yep, the cactus. The there you go. Mushrooms. The lion's name. <laughs> yeah, lion's yep. We got the seasoned uh, 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 goat cheese. Mm. Goat Smear cheese. that over that. Pork Next loin. thing you know, you could put any other whatever additives you want to do on top of the goat cheese, mm. whatnot. But you take that pork loin with the goat cheese and roll that bad boy. Mm. 
back up. Mm. Take some of those strings, you know, those cooking strings, yeah. you tie a bad tie boy up, up yeah. put that thing in don't there. Uh, uh, some people though. smoke yeah. it. Just, 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 that some people smoke it. Just, that thing sounds so good. I was like, that thing sounds so good. I don't eat pork, but that thing sounds so good. Yes, bro. So we could do it with a turkey loin. I do it with a turkey loin. Do it with plank steak. What do you call it? You can do it with 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 steak. Get the steak, pound out the steak. I do it with a turkey loin. Okay. Whatever. Roll it. Piece of flounder. What What's the name of I don't know the name of it. I just saw it done, and I was like, and I tried it, and it worked. I, I, I just know that if I have to go over somebody's house when this COVID lifts, I'm going over to Chester's house. Cause the way right. Wait till I way. get the actual smoker, though. I did this with the grill, with the oven. I did it with the oven, but if I had the actual smoker. Can we go to the barbecue? It'd have, man, it'd have had a whole nother coat, because I'd have had, I'd have put the, um... The um with a smoker, I don't know what it is about a smoker and as opposed to a uh, conventional oven. But when you base things with like barbecue sauce and things like that, I don't know what it is about the smoker. But that bitch be staying on there, boy. Mm. I'll be like, man, mm. hallelujah. Me time my bow tie. Time my making me food. hungry, bro. You win, boy. I love it. International <laughs> Albino Day. <laughs> hey, man, what holidays is it today? Don't worry about it, man. I ain't done. International. Well, we were doing the month. We were doing the month first. We did the month first. What is that? Um, Albinism. Albinism. Albinism Is a rare, non-contagious, genetically inherited condition found in all countries across the world, regardless of background or culture. Identified by the lack of melanin in the eyes, skin, and hair, making one prone to sun and bright lights. Uh, those with albinism, albinism, oh, I keep saying it wrong. Albinism has faced discrimination and violence. This day is set apart to stand up against the bullies who targeted them. Mm. So yeah, albinism. Wow. They were there was a time where they were actually thought to uh, be magical, and that's why they killed yeah. them off. Mm. Oh, it was in um, oh, where was that? Tanzania. I think in Tanzania they were killing them off. Like they, it was like seventy that they, like upwards of seventy mm. that they got. And eventually somebody was like, "Y'all stop being stupid." All right, International Traffic Light Day. Mm. What? Patented by Garrett Morgan in 1923, <laughs> he also invented. <laughs> he also invented. <laughs> he also, <laughs> also invented a breathing device in the form of a canvas hood. A precursor to the modern gas mask. Garrett Morgan. With the swish. Yeah, National Traffic Light Day. International, because they're used everywhere. They're everywhere. Even if they don't use them, they're there. Wow. You ever been to a country like that? They're just hanging. Yeah, Trinidad. Trinidad's one of them. No turning lanes. Nobody cares about the lights here. (laughs) National Oyster Day. Hey. Yeah? Mm-hmm. You like oysters? Mm-hmm. You go, girl. Oh, huh? I eat conch before I eat oysters. Who? Conch. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'll eat conch before I eat oysters. What's the difference? A whole heap. I mean, it's a lot. It's Yeah, you're right, but it's kind of the same. I haven't Rubber, gotten past. substance. I was about to say, I haven't gotten past the slimy aspect oh, of oysters. Oh, yeah. To get Put to the truth. Hot, hot sauce and horseradish on there and sprinkle lemon and some garlic. Oh, inside. yeah? Mm-hmm. That's a lot. Oh, whoa. So we didn't need that sound she had to do the sound effect. She was like, "Let me show you. I'm a pro. Let me show you. I'm a pro." <laughs> <laughs> the thoughts, views expressed by the see. thoughts, views, and hey. attitude expressed by Miss Work. Who? That's what's up. No longer are are that of Miss Work. <laughs> it's not that of just chilling radio. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, she ain't responsible, huh? <laughs> I do not condone any of this. I'm just playing. I do. Um, National Psychiatric Technician Appreciation Day. Oh, nice. So, uh, <laughs> now. No. Shit no. no. Technician. Technician. No. Technician. National Psychiatric Technician Appreciation Day. So the guys that the next one. The guys that Google this one. You gotta appreciate everybody. See, wait till I get to the next one. Yeah, just wait. <laughs> Those are the guys that put people in the actual straight jackets. Yeah. So. They get hit. Yeah, the text do all the work. They get on. They get, you know. Text do the work. Defecated Surge on. Surge of text. Wow. If you put a name, if you put tech and then something, they do most of the work. They do the hard labor. I'd love to meet somebody who does that job and ask them how they got into it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, nobody else was hiring. 
Yeah, basically. Because <laughs> I'm basically, like, well, my bro, mom worked It wasn't because I care about people. What made you want to do that job? Was just wasn't that care about people? Rent. Or or he went in, <laughs> or he went into a billion in coding and it was like, ah, that's too much to memorize. Let me just go over here and take be a technician. Oh, they got a I don't know. Yeah, they do. Oh yeah. Shout out to Facebook. What is it? What is it that you say? Word, 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 word. It's awesome. And it just says word, 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 word. So bored. All right. Also, National Underwear Day. There goes, there goes word, word, word. Oh my god. We're jerks. We're jerks. No, we're geeks. We're not jerks. We're geeks. National Underwear. National Underwear Day. This day promotes an opportunity. Opportunity. <laughs> Much like every day, to wear your favorite undergarments. What Boxers, the- briefs, panties, tidy whities are all know. welcome. They all provide that layer of comfort. Mother always said, make wow. sure you always wear clean underwear. Okay, you never know. You can actually celebrate by embracing your body. Post a picture with the hashtag oh, National oh Underwear my. Day. Is this wow. what they're trying like to do? Marky Mark is that what they're trying um, to do? They're trying to get people to take pictures in their underwear? Are they serious? I'm trying to wear underwear. Who did Listen, that? Like Justin Bieber did it. That is Some, brilliant. So, somebody explain this this thing to me. Why does why did mothers tell you to make sure that you have on clean underwear in because case you get if into you a die. accident? <laughs> What's the first thing they do? You break your leg. What are they doing? They're taking your, cutting your, they're clothes, cutting off. your clothes off. They're yeah, cutting them off anyway. Boy. Then why you have, have boobs? You have on stinky pants. Yeah, no, I'm not saying boobs. I'm just <laughs> saying. I just never. I never. I guess I just what, never put two and two you don't together. Want the only, the what's the, I'm not thinking about my drawers if I get in a car accident. What's the main accident? stain in drawers though? Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. I don't, wait, don't have. Wait, 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 I don't, wait, wait, I don't got no stains. No, I'm saying. I'm like. I'm like. Will I am? I'm one of those like potentially anal. The OCD, no, literally, very OCD when it comes he to that is. department. It's, it's, well, you should because I, you this, know, do you this have is, a bidet at home? I do. I don't have a bidet. I do. But you know there are it's man the wipes <laughs> See, that go. That's along. my BAP's favorite. Moment. I, I know <laughs> that's a very metro thing, but whatever. I like a clean butt, so you know, that makes sense. Well, we got flushable wipes, not the non-flushable flushable ones. wipes. Flushable. That's what I'm talking about yes, as well. You so should. you know, I'm not going to have no railroad tracks going. You tell on. them, that's boss. Real. You tell them. I'm <laughs> just saying. Yeah. That's real. <laughs> but hypothetically speaking, hypothetically speaking, <laughs> to welcome him back to my conversation. Yes, right, Mister. I take over somebody. I want to talk to people or whatever. Oh, man. Who, who invited this guy? <laughs> there's, a whole, say, there's an unreleased song by the by her name. Ooh. <laughs> that I can't wait to hear. We can pull it up. I can't wait to hear. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Yeah, I'm waiting Mass on this one. Work. Oh, We're is. almost done. We're almost done. We're almost done. Work like a dog day. What? Dogs don't? Oh, Never mind. Watch. Watch this. Watch this. It's not only for those that work like a dog, preferably. <laughs> this day gives the chance to display the grit and determination normally demonstrated by canines. Ah. Such mm-hmm. dogs that pull sleds, sniffer dogs in the mountains, and police dogs, farm dogs, you know them herder dogs, and also service and therapy dogs. They're all welcome. So shout out to all the day. dogs that hold down Ruff, Ruff. Shout out to the dogs that get to go in places that other dogs can't. Ooh. Service. Yeah, really. I mean, service are we talking about like dogs, dogs? Service and therapy or like all men who are dogs? Therapy or dogs? No. Just dogs? Oh, that wow. day would be this for your own like show. Okay. Like you can talk I about that. I just to know. I mean, I had a friend who texted me who wanted to know. That's, that's so That's funny. just for a friend. Listen, I mean, it wasn't me. When work is in your name. <laughs> that's so funny. And you find yourself in meetings, uh-huh. places uh-huh. that other people can't go. Uh-huh. Yes. Are you Are you feeling what I'm saying? I got it. I got it. I got it. I was That's just asking nicest, for a friend. That's nicest all. way just for you to say that too. That was saying, great. I'm not just asking to for a friend. Up, it's like you know her. It it's like you know her. All right. It is also to bav. T U next word B apostrophe A V. To bav. It is a minor Jewish holiday in modern day Israel. This day is celebrated as a holiday of love, mm. similar to Valentine's Day. Aww. You feel me? Happy See how Miko just slid right in there? He's helping out. 
Too bad. Too bad. It's been said to be a great day to get too married. Too bad. Too bad. It is too bad. Today? Today is too bad. So too August 5th. No, August too 5th, bar. too bar. Is, is it the same date every year? I Yes, as far okay. as what I've been too bar. Either too bar. that or the first uh, Wednesday. It might be just the first Wednesday of, okay. every, of August. I'm going to get married on Think too bar. Me go away. Uh, this, this used to be so the second oh, temple oh. period. <laughs> you can't get married on too bar. What is that? <laughs> because too bar day is in August, and August is still the entanglement month. It is entanglement month. So it can be entanglement awareness. It's celebrated with dates. It's celebrated with dates, flowers, candy, all that good stuff. So, you know. I'm taking applications. That's all I'm saying. August 5th. Love triangle. Survey says. Bing. Entanglement. (laughs) Oh. I'm sorry, dear. Pardon me. Fat footed. That was the foot. Um. The actual. uh, This used to be the second temple period version of a singles mixer. The Jewish women would go dancing in the vineyard. And the unmarried men would go to the fields and pick a wife. Hmm. I think they did a little more in a haystack. (laughs) That's all I'm saying. We're just going to leave that there. Let it float. Let it it be, Mm -hmm. let it be. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, I did want to bring up some other news that I had, right? Mm -hmm. So, real quick, while Serge is on the way back. Uh, Facebook launches its own TikTok rival called Instagram Reels. So everybody pay attention to that. Record and edit 15-second videos can be shared on Instagram uh, in its own section and your story. So, yes, Instagram Reels, that just came out. It's on Facebook? uh, Instagram. It's a little on Instagram. And if you go to, you know how you follow Instagram? Mm -hmm. If you go to Instagram themselves, they'll show you that they just came out with this Mm -hmm. today. Uh, as soon as Microsoft buys TikTok, it's going to mm-hmm. be a wrap. I need them to do that so that they can take all the bugs out and the uh, actual all um, the illegal the stuff. Yeah. On yeah. What's illegal? Well, it's like, they, doesn't it have, have malware on it? Like, well, it's not illegal because you're signing an agreement that you give that out is, all personal information from mm-hmm. your phone to TikTok. As far yes. as your information on logging a cash app and yeah. your bank account information, whatever that's logging this year. Yep. Is you that why 45 is mad? Hmm. But Possibly. you people forget that was the same thing they did with Facebook Messenger. Facebook Messenger has made you sign the same thing. Oh, absolutely. And Facebook Messenger, mm-hmm. Facebook's owned partially by the government themselves already. So we already went over that story last year. So yeah, you know, yeah, yeah we just chilling. Um, Coach Meg, aka Megan the Stallion, modeled for Coach. Seems like uh, she's recovering like a champ, as they would say. Both feet. I'm a savage. Both feet had holes in them. Anyway, you know, doctors do amazing things these days. I wonder if she's still a savage. I think she's considered more of a savage because she didn't shot really savage. like... like two shots. To she feet. didn't really come out like like a whiny baby about no, it. You know? And she, no, a lot of things could happen. A lot of things could happen. She could have easily made a phone call. Mm-hmm. And homeboy could be just like... Done. Struck up. Yeah, exactly. Because mm-hmm. a lot of guys, like even me, I'm a, I'm a, I'm, a, I have two little sisters. Mm-hmm. Let my sister call me, tell me some somebody boy, shot me. Yep. Yeah, just for mm-hmm. Cleveland. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm going to jail. Yeah. Proudly. Yeah. Yes. I think the best thing that the country did for Tory Lanez was deport him back to Canada. Has he been deported though? Yeah, he's deported. That's recently. Because they were saying he was on. He was on today. Said he wasn't. Didn't they? Didn't yet. That he has. He said he's been hanging out. He said I've been quarantining with my family. I heard they yeah quarantined and they saw him at McDonald's. Yeah, like I saw a report. Today, I mean, that's McDonald's in Canada. So I don't know. No, I don't know. For that? real, what if he did? Yeah, get I don't know, but I think that would be a good look if they did for him. Well, yeah, because like, like, like you said, Miko. I mean, one phone call and that's yeah. And the thing is, what what shows can he do? What events can he do? Like sure. you're a target right now. <clears throat> I feel you. So that will yeah, ain't my fault. Who can tell me about the Ellen DeGeneres situation? Woo! Anyone? I don't know. Anyone? Um, no. Can you? No, tell me what happened. Can you? Uh, from what I was hearing, a couple of her executive producers, she's got like three of them. They were, uh, one of them was playing with dudes, you know, private parts. Another what, dude. The guys? 
Yeah. So it's not Ellen herself. Supposedly it's not, but uh, a couple of people are saying she's not the nicest person in the world. Well, they yeah, can say that all that. you want to. Because but there's she... also people that are saying she's just real professional, like super. Well, she is perfectionist. Though, with... so. Okay, so, but as I far don't know, as I just think people are coming. Well, the scandal is is there's mad sexual. I think people are in cancel culture too problem. tough. That's what it is. No, no. I, well, I the, the, the three executive producers. I ain't gonna lie. They always do have somebody. I personally love Ellen. Check see if she's gonna make a power. Move, but right. I check think, see if she's gonna right. make a move. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah. Then that she's about might to buy something, is. do something. He did that to Bill Cosby. Right. He's about to buy the network. Now right. he got, now, now these women from thirty years ago about to say they they got, yeah. got a. They're got trying a to bring to her tell. down for the people around her, which is like. You know how but it is, they're man. they're throwing a lot of stuff against the wall and just looking for something to stick. Yeah. Yeah. Right, what right. She do? I, I you know what I'm saying? That's like, the thing. With somebody's balls or something? No, what did she do? no. Well, no, her one of her executive no, producers was doing that with a lot of the people that were that wanting to be on the show. Her? It's because it's her name it's on her the, name the, on the wall. brand. It's her brand. Oh, okay. Remember, yeah. This is all because, because she's got to be able to shut like, that down like weird. immediately. Just like somebody that, that just like a, a, a Karen, they just can't like blame a Karen the guy does some crazy. The balls. They got to blame the person yeah. that owns the company. Exactly. Like, like, say, for instance, Miko is shooting a, a movie and one of the, the key grips was messing around with a chick. Now it's Miko's fault, even though Miko ain't got nothing to do with that. Yeah, Dude, yeah, yeah. if you're shooting video movies uh, for, for Disney and you do something crazy behind the scenes and it wasn't even on your video camera or anything that like, deal with Disney, yeah, but yeah. they find it, you're fired. Yeah. Okay. Done, done. Yeah, because you do not. You oh, do no, not I thought you made it sound like the media and the fans were like saying it's her mm. fault. That well, there's still some people that are out there saying that she's she had a policy where you can't look her in the eyes. That's why. That's, that's, that's why y'all need to go crystal clear. That comes. Really and can I say I, mean, I love that? That's that, that, so like that in New York. That's, you can't that's go why y'all need to go crystal clear so we can help y'all with y'all brain. That's a New York policy. Go crystal clear. Dot biz. Somebody might. Can I say that I used to play for to understand the brand in the little league? My my little league team's name is Crystal Clear. Hey, matter of fact, do a favor. Cue up just the beginning by Iman Omari. Gotcha. Just the beginning. All right. Check that out. Mainly because. I hope y'all understand the, 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 the fact that I have to cut all of this energy off because it is the end of our show. No! And, we, see, went, and we went over. We went over. <laughs> That's how nice it is here. That's how wonderful like, the energy Like, time flies so quick. Exactly. Yes. Exactly. Well, thank you for having us. No, not for us. We're good. But, of course, thank you for coming through. That's right. No, we're, gonna, we got, we're definitely going to be seeing a lot of got I got time. Dwayne from A DGM Life. By way of by way of by way of crystal clear. That's right. right. And we have the crystal, Ms. Yeah. Work Hill. That's right. Of crystal clear and some more stuff. Facts. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> I take it. I will take it. <laughs> For real though, sincerely, <laughs> with your oyster eating stuff. Right. Um, that was oysters. Excuse that was oyster me. demonstration, guys. Oyster demonstration. But. For real, thank you so much for coming through. Thank you for having me. Of course, I'm of course. honored. I'm so glad I learned so much more about you this evening. Me like too. serious, like I've learned a lot about you too. I didn't know you were in the Navy, and we got we got to talk. We got to talk. Yeah, we got definitely, to. definitely. Um, and about some more things too, because there's a lot going on in the city, and a lot of things that uh, are going to happen. We have to yeah. come back. And do tell. Oh, we have to. We, it, you have a uh, an open invitation. Thank you. For any project you're working on with Facts, any artist that fits the genre, of course. Yeah, the genre. No rappers, please. Yeah, no, yeah, no, no, yeah, no. yeah. But Flow Ohio Radio has plenty of shows for, for rappers. Oh, okay. Cool. So we will be able to accommodate. Cool. Aha. Uh-huh. See how I did that? See how I did that? Mm. So now, as we always do, I'm going to take a moment from you and I will excuse myself. To the chillers and chillettes. I'm talking to the camera right here. Camera right here. Oh, one right here. Hey, camera. First off, thank y'all for tuning in, sticking around. You knew it was going down. You knew. Matter of fact, it it, 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 it exponentially grew. Didn't you sense it? We are just chilling. We always try to make sure that we leave here better than we came here, right? Yesterday, eh, it's gone. But it prepared us for today, which makes us even better for tomorrow. Do not forget, tomorrow is coming. So therefore, be prepared today for what is coming your way. Love yourself so that you can love other people better. And we can live better together. 
And with that, I bid you and you and you adieu. All right, let's control. See y'all next time. We just chilling. Mika White. Just chilling. Just chilling.